You're live. I already did the ping. I goofed. I already did the ping. I'm sorry. I'm not getting ice cream. There were some technical difficulties. I'm not wearing a wig, but welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. Welcome. I literally just got home like an hour ago, maybe, after not being home for like a day and a half. And I showered. And I, now I'm here. It's not a wig. I'm not wearing... I don't wear a wig. It's not a wig. What do you mean, wait, it's a wig. I don't wear a wig. Well, I'm going to talk about it. I'm going to talk about it. First thing we're doing today is I want to talk about my little trip because it was a fun trip. Then we're going to do the background contest. There's only 20 submissions. It shouldn't take too long. And then we'll spend the rest of the time doing Feebas Friday, of course. Wig envy is crazy. I'm not wearing a wig, though. I'm not bald. I'm not bald. Something a bald person would say? A bald person would say, hey, I'm bald. Look, I'm bald is what a bald person would say. Chris got ice cream. I didn't, okay. Okay. You know what? You know what? Let's just, let's just talk. Let's just talk, you and me, chat. You know? It's been a couple days. We didn't stream at the regularly scheduled stream times this week. We did, what, Wednesday and Friday? That's kind of weird. There was no video this week. That was kind of weird. Should be coming out ASAP, but we will see. If not, there will be one for next week. Hello, Cloth. I'm not trying to say anything about bald. Okay, okay, okay. A bald person just recognizes they're bald. Look, you're bald. Right here. Look at, look at, right here. Right over here. You're bald, and you're saying you're bald. I don't need, if I'm bald, I would say I'm bald. <laughs> Take a chat, hello. Never said you're bald, you just have a wig. I'm just, I, I have a different haircut, but I like to wear this one. Yes. Let's talk about this work trip. Let's talk about this work trip. Because this is what kind of threw a wrench into the week for us. Because it kind of came up out of nowhere. But the thing is with my little work trip, is I didn't do work at all. No, 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 no. I didn't do any work in reality. In reality, my work decided to pay me to learn how to ski. Which is a really weird thing. What is grandma's story? I don't know what you're talking about. I, uh, probably the hairline and the abnormal distribution of hair? You... I don't have an ab... Do I have an abnormal distribution? I have normal hair. I have normal hair. I don't know who Grandma Flexington is. Anyways, anyways, anyways. For the past day, I have been in Bartlett, New Hampshire, Mount Atitash, which isn't the furthest north in New Hampshire, but it's pretty dang close to Vermont and Canada. It is a skiing location, a resort, if you would. And, uh,. My boss has got a condo and they sent five of us to go and myself and one other coworker don't know how to ski. So they got us skiing lessons. And I learned to do that today. I was skiing all day today and just got home. Last night we get there, you know, it's kind of late at night. We all grab dinner. Everyone's calling me chins and shit like that. But it's nothing I'm not used to. So uh, uh, we went on with the night. We played beer pong because of course we did. Deca Chad! Womp womp. Let's go three or five months. Excuse me. Of course, five months. You're almost at the gold badge. Let's go. Let's go. But we play beer pong for a while and we get, you know, a little, a little buzzed. And then we have to go to bed, you know, and it's five people in this condo. Three of them are dudes, including me, and two of them are girls. Aqua Quoka. One month. Let's go. Let's go. That is a new badge. That is a new badge. Let's go. Next one's at three, I think. But anyways, an 80s sitcom. But anyways, there's two bedrooms in this place, two separate bedrooms. And then there's one bedroom that's kind of open and it has bunk beds. The other two have their own bed. And because it would be an HR problem, if not doing it this way, the girls got their own rooms and I was assigned a bunk bed. Here's the thing. Here's the thing if you don't know this about me, and I think a lot of you don't. I think a lot of you don't realize this, but but look, look. Look at this. I'm 
I'm very tall. I'm a very tall person. And these bunk beds were twin beds. In fact, hang on, let me let me pull up the screen. Let me pull up the screen. Let me share a window. I'm not three foot, I'm six foot five. Let me pull up a window. Uh where is this window? I don't know, I'll pull up my display. Okay. Okay. Look, if we're talking bunk beds here, and they're twin beds, this is kind of how it looks, right? These are twin bunk beds. And I was assigned a bottom bunk, okay? There's another pair of them. The other two people took the uh, top and bottom on that side. I got my own bunk bed. If it's me, a six foot five guy, and I'm laying in a twin bunk bed, it's gonna look something like this. This is my head. This is my torso. This is my legs. I don't fit. I don't fit in the goddamn bunk bed. I literally, I, I had like ass up fucking one of these. One of those actions. Too huge for it. So that wasn't gonna work. I wasn't gonna sleep there because I had to get up at like 8 in the morning and go straight to the mountain to get my ski lessons. I was like, I can't sleep on that. I will not sleep. I've been drinking and playing beer pong. It's not gonna happen. So what did I do? But I slept on the couch. Downstairs. And I woke up every single time somebody went shit. Every time someone had to shit, I would wake up and go, it's not happening, go back to sleep, they're not shitting. It's not happening. It's not happening. So I didn't get lots of sleep last night. <laughs> How many doo-doos? I woke up four times. <laughs> I think everyone was embarrassed to shit in front of their coworkers, particularly of the opposite gender. <laughs> So they would do it in the middle of the night when they expected everyone else to be asleep. That, that is what it, that's what it was like. That's what I was waking up to. Bro, I didn't come, okay. <laughs> that's fucked up. Oh. But either way, either way, either way. I get up at eight, I'm groggy, I'm a little hungover, I'm all stuffed up, I'm like, I got a little cold going still from the past couple of weeks. I'm like, oh, oh, it's not a good start. And we go right over to the mountain. And I'm a beginner. The only time I've ever skied before, even as a New Hampshire resident, was when I was five years old. Apparently I took ski lessons and I don't remember. I also took snowboard lessons when I was like eight or nine, but I fell on my butt a lot and I hated it. I cried. <laughs> so I haven't done anything like that in probably like two decades. It's been 20 years since I ever tried skiing, which is a really scary thing to say out loud now that I think about it. Um, but we have to go rent some stuff because I don't own any ski things. 20 years ago, I was like this big. 20 years later, now today, I am six foot five and can't sleep in the bunk bed. So we go down to the rental thing and I'm like, hi, I need the biggest boots you have. And I need skis and I need poles. And I look over at my coworker and she's talking with some other lady getting the rental stuff. They're like, here you go. Go ahead. All right, go get them. You're all set. Go. And the guy looks at me and he's like, you, you, this is your first time skiing, is it not? I was like, <laughs> I lie. I go, yes. Yeah, yeah, it is. You know, he's like, look, I'm really going to help you out. I'm going to make sure everything you do, all the equipment you have is perfect. I want to make sure you do good and you come back again and you love skiing. I was like, my man, absolutely hook me up, dog. Let's do it. And I see him turn around and walk over and he goes to these ski things and he pulls out mediums. And I don't know what that means, an M. I don't know what the number on it means. And he's like, you're going to want these. They're a little short. And if the instructor wants you to go higher, you can go higher, but I think you'll have the most control of these. And I'm like, I trust you. I trust you. You said you're going to help me. I'll take them. I'll put them to my side and take them. Perfect. And then I watch him go over to a box. I'm quieter? Are you sure? Turn up your volume. <laughs> Looks the same to me. Hang on. Nah, turn up your volume. 
I see him go over to a box, and I look at the box, and he's pulling out the poles, and it says for five foot nine to six foot one people. I went, wait a minute. Wait, no, I'm six five. What, what does he think? It's on the sheet I handed him. Why, why are you getting the six foot one poles and below? He's like, these will be perfect. And make sure when you put these skis, you're using these poles here when you're using them, put your arm through the strap this way and hold it like this, because if you don't, you'll break your thumb. Thank you. Have a nice day. I was like, you could break your thumb? And then he put me on my way. <laughs> so now I'm nervous. And I don't know if these are the right things, but I trust him. You know? And I go to the ski lesson. And we go out there. And there's a giant group of five-year-olds. And myself and my coworker. Me, six foot five, again, very big guy. Very big guy, grown man, beard having guy, and ski outfit. <laughs> and a bunch of five year olds. And out comes the instructor. Two guys come out in reality the instructor and some other dude. The other dude comes up and he's like, What's your name? I'm like, Chris Piche. And he's like, I know a Chris Piche. I was like, You do? He's like, Yeah, great man, Chris Piche. I was like, now you know two, haha. And he's like, no, I know one Chris Bache. And then he just walks away. And I'm like, okay. And the other guy walks over. And he's the actual instructor. And right before we went to this lesson, one of our other coworkers, a very talented skier, someone who skied for years and years and years, very good at it, said, you guys should be good. As long as your instructor is a young person. If it's an old guy, you're in trouble. And out comes a 90-year-old man with British looking teeth and looks right through us. You know, he's not looking at us in the face. He's just like, which is not good. I know Chris Bache, I love Chris Acola. That would, I'd leave. I'd leave if that happened. That'd be a nightmare for me. <laughs> but he comes out and he's like, you ever skied? I'm like, no. And he's like, ah, okay. And he divides us into groups. And we are a group of three people. It's me, my coworker, and a kid. And he goes, All right, everyone, my name's Luddy. And I'm going to teach you how to ski. I look at his name tag, and his name tag literally says Luddy. And in my head, I go, I'm from New Hampshire, and I'm a streamer. That name sounds really familiar. I go, Luddy, is that, is that short for Ludwig? And he goes, No. My name's John. I went, what? Why did they, why is your nickname Luddy? And he goes, oh, I don't know. My, uh, my students like to call me that. I don't know why. So I just go by Luddy. It's kind of cringe. It's quite cringe. We haven't done the backgrounds yet. I'm talking a little story before we start. Kind of cringe. If it's what I think it is. That's the equivalent of you guys going to your teacher and going, ha 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 to the thug shaker chins. And your teacher's like, okay, I guess my name's chins now. That is cringe. <laughs> Don't ever do that. <laughs> Don't ever convince an old man his name is chins because you watch me. If that is the case, please don't do that. <laughs> Anyways, anyways, the next thing Luddy John tells us is I have a memory problem. I go, that's not good. He goes, yeah, I have really bad memory. I probably won't remember your name by the end of this lesson, Chris. I go, that's not what I want to hear about someone who's teaching me something, a lesson, something that actually puts my life in danger. I could apparently break my thumbs. That is not good. And he takes us over to the little bunny hill, right? On the way there, I take a tumble because I don't know how to ski. And he has not taught us how to ski yet. So I fall on my ass. And I can't get up. I don't know if you know this. I'm six foot five. I'm built like a badminton birdie. When you fall on your skis, your knees are still up, right? Your skis are planted on the ground and you're kind of laying flat or to the side or however it is. My legs, up to the knee, are about two feet of me. The other four and a half feet is what's laying there and what has to get pulled up from the ground. I don't have that kind of arm strength to throw up 200 pounds, 
four and a half feet of human six feet in the air. I don't have the power to do that. So I say, Luddy, Luddy, how do I get up? And he goes, get up! <laughs> I go, ah, I can't! And he goes, just get up! So uh, whenever I fall, I just have to take off the skis and take the L. Just get up, nerd. It ain't that hard. <laughs> it, was, it was like impossible. It was like a backwards push-up, but into a full stand-up. He just goes, get up. <laughs> but we get to the uh, we get to the bunny hill after that. And he's he's kind of, you know, teaching us how to ski. Skiing is basically this, right? It's just going down a hill and going left to right so you don't barrel and go terminal velocity straight down. It's just you go left and right so you slow down until you get to the end. The shirt is making the story. What's weird about my shirt? It's a normal shirt. Nothing weird about my shirt. But he's like, all right, go left. And we we learn how to turn left. And he's like, all right, go right. And we're like, we learn how to do that. And he's like, break your falls. And we're like, well, I'm not going to fall. And he's like, all right, now ski backwards. And I'm nervous and I'm skiing backwards. But finally, eventually, I start doing it. I start going left and right. I'm like, I'm skiing. I'm doing it. I'm skiing. No, none of my coworkers have seen this shirt. <laughs> the other thing that was weird about the lesson was he totally did remember my name the whole time. He liked me, but he was dogging on me the whole time. My coworker did a good job. She did fine her first time skiing as well. She's going like slowly, you know, getting the turns. He's like, good work, you. I don't remember your name. And then I'd go. He'd be like, Chris! And there's like a, a million kids skiing in front of me, like children, five-year-olds. I would barrel into them and he's like, Chris, go! I'm like, what? no, there's, there's a five-year-old there. And he's like, go, come on, go! <laughs> and then I'd do a good job and I'd be all proud about it. I'd get to the bottom and be like, I skied. And he'd come up to us and be like, ha, Chris did the worst. It's my first day, John, Luddy. The fuck? What do you mean, dog? Why are you dogging on me? What did I do? Why am I getting bullied by goddamn John? I don't know if we'll have time for Ace Attorney, but I won't say that we can't. I'm not dog water. It's okay, well, okay. Anyways, he puts us in a group together and he's like, Now when your friends take you up to that mountain there, make sure you go left and right. You are born skiers and you're ready. And we're like, okay. And we go eat some lunch and, you know, do our thing. We get together with our group of uh, co-workers. We're like, all right, let's go up to the to the mountain. We're like, okay, all right. We go up to like the easiest mountain. We take the ski lift up and we get off at the easiest mountain. And immediately, when my skis touch the ground there, when my skis hit the ground there, and my other coworker who did the lessons with me, her skis hit the ground. We look at each other in the eyes and we start laughing because it felt like we were trained to play basketball and we just started playing water polo. This was not the same. These were not, this was not one level up. This was not the next step up from the bunny hill. This was completely different. This was final boss. <laughs> All right. We go down, we go around. We actually survive getting off the lift. We don't fall over, but we're like frozen. We're like, we can't go down this. And our other coworkers are just like flying around doing their shit. One kid is doing like 180s and stuff, like jumping in the air and doing like a 360 with his skis. And we're just at the top like. And let me tell you something, chat. I, I, I tried my darndest to get down that goddamn hill. The smallest hill at the resort. I didn't fall once. I didn't fall twice. I fell 11 times today. Trying to ski down this goddamn hill. The easiest hill in the resort. 11 times. 11 times. It got so bad, I was halfway down 
I have to take my skis off every time I fall because I can't get back up. It got so bad I get halfway down, I fall, and the guy, one of my coworkers, who's doing like 180s and shit on his little skis, comes over. He's like a runner, you know? He's like, oh, the other day we got bored and me and my friends got together. We ran 32 miles and it took us nine hours. Usually it's a two-day thing. We got bored and did it in nine hours. How? Did you bring meals? I get winded when I walk too fast up the stairs. You got bored and just ran for nine hours? Potentially broke records? And here he is trying to help me on this hill. And I had just fallen over and I'm like on the edge of like the actual slope. He's like, yeah, you know, just, just skirt around, go down the thing, hit the ramp and come back up. I'm like, no. And he's like trying to help me for 25 minutes. 25 minutes of him like, yeah, just jump into a 180 and you'll be back in the... the. <laughs> and eventually, you know, he just looks at me and he's like all disappointed because I'm like, I can't move. I cannot move without falling over. And he's just like, have you considered giving up? Why don't you, why don't you just walk down the hill? So I didn't even make it down the goddamn mountain. I fell 11 times, took lessons all day, and I didn't even get down the hill. I walked down half of it. I was in, I, okay. I. <laughs> it's not like a super embarrassing thing because I don't know any of the people there, but my coworkers were there and they just watched me walk down the hill with my skis in my hands. I went, ugh. I'm like one of the oldest guys there. I'm six foot five and there I am, this big dude just, yep, can't do it. I'm gonna walk down the easiest hill, get to the, maybe we can go to the lodge and have a hot cocoa. How does that sound? <laughs> he does, he does sound like a part of chat. They all feel like chat. They all uh, treat me equally the same, you know? <laughs> what I ended up learning is my coworkers took a look at my gear and we told them about Luddy. They were like, first of all, your instructor taught you nothing. You learned how to turn right and left. You don't know how to ski. I went, oh, I really thought I was skiing. And then they looked at my gear and they said, your skis are way too small. It's supposed to be up to your chin. That's like the easiest ski to use. This guy gave me skis that were like here. And poles for a six foot one person. It was a half a foot too small for me. So I had no chance. I had no chance up to your chins. Yes. Yes. No, I will not give up on the fee bass. <laughs> I guess at the end of the day, the moral of the story is if you want to be a good skier, don't learn from a 90 year old man, potentially who has dementia named Luddy. When his name's not Ludwig, it's John. Don't do that. <laughs> I'm no better of a skier than I was yesterday when I had never skied. In my memory, at least. I guess I did when I was five. <laughs> but that was my trip. <laughs> anyways, anyways, we got stuff to do today. He, he did not teach us pizza and french fry. That never came up once. Apparently, it's like a bad habit to get into doing pizza and french fry. Apparently, that's like not good for you if you're trying to like seriously ski. But he didn't teach us shit. <laughs> he just said, lean to the left, lean to the right. Now you got it. You're a skier. But we have stuff to do today. We have things we got to do today. First and foremost, we got to do the background contest. We've had January's background as our channel background for a day too long. One day too long. And it needs to be updated. It needs to. So today, I'm gonna let you guys vote between 20 entries. We had 20 this month. And I'll make sure, whoopsies. I will make sure that as this is on the screen, we sit in the middle as to not offend, as to not be a problem here. There's me, hello, I'm right here. 20 entries, and if I remember right, 
These are some really good entries. There's some good stuff in here. Do you guys feel ready? It's the extra day was because it's peak. The extra day, yes, because it's peak and I was on a peak and I couldn't get down from the peak without falling 11 times. It looks like you guys are ready. It looks like you're ready. Let me make sure I'm all set to go. We have our bracket ready here. Let's do it. First off, on the left, if you're new, you're going to be voting left or right, L or R, when these come up, when these appear uh, uh, in chat. On the left, we have... What the fuck? I don't want to print it. Number nine against number 14. Number nine on the left is by Peter Adamski. We are looking at... <laughs> fitting with today. Missing. Feebass. Information needed. <laughs> captured. Captured. Uh, it, you know, those, those would be great if they weren't gone. If we didn't delete those save files. On the right, number 14 by Saving Throws. We're doing both of your entries, I believe. But this is the better one of the two, according to you. Pokemon Goob Edition with Gooby, my favorite fake mon of all time. And us pogging and many chat messages such as Gooby needs to be here. Gooby is the goat. Gooby got together with a Lickitung because he's a freak with it. Chat, is it going to be the left? Or is it going to be the right? Start voting now. Was your first Pokemon game Goob version? It is tough already. I think there's going to be a lot of tough matchups today. I think there will be. Jube making a gooning joke. It kept going through the stream. <laughs> is that goobing? If you're Juber and you're gooning? The left is in the lead here. 57% of you voting for it. 21 votes are in. I will give it 10 more seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It is going to be the left. Also, welcome Kennedy to the channel. I hope you are watching. Welcome. The left is moving on to the next round. Up next. We have number six on the left and number 16 on the right. On the left by Peter again, fear. I fear no man, but that thing. It scares me, Feebas. On the right, I did not post this. I don't know who posted this. Scottish man, uh, it's the drawing of me based on what chat said. Is it gonna be the left or the right? If you're on mobile and you can't see, L is up, R is down. Start voting now. I like the idea that this fish becomes Chris's whole identity and he will never obtain it. Today's the day. Today's the day, okay? We, get, we pull in a good background this afternoon, this evening. We get that locked in and we catch a Feebas. That's today's dream. Right is not peak. This is one of my worst drawings. <laughs> <laughs> it is not peak. You're almost positive. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The left is in the lead here, 54% of you. Most of you have voted. I'll give it five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. The left moves on again. Peter with two in the next round. Congratulations, Peter. Next. This is a really tough matchup this month. A lot of tough matchups. Up next, we are looking at number 19 on the left against number 20 on the right. Number 19 by Joe Broski. We have... The fuck is this? <laughs> How does it keep coming back? How does Boy Kisser appear in the goddamn background contest every goddamn month? The Boy Kisser Dollar against Gazer, who I believe just submitted this. A Chris Pache background. Yoink! The shiny Maku hit up from the Parish Song run, wearing Born to Fish, Forced to Work, a Typhlosion with 1 HP. Revenge from the Kirby. MAGM! <laughs> Rest in peace, I guess. Shiny Zigzagoon, the Wheel of Awful Apartment Items, and When the Hell Will You Catch Me, Chins Pache. Will it be the left? Or will it be the right? I have more good news today, by the way. Speaking of this Kirby threatening me in the corner. This was returned to my possession. We got it back. We got it back. 
Let's go! Let's go! The right is crushing. The right is crushing. 21 votes. It is so over. It is so over. The right wins. The white... The, the white... I don't, don't say that, Chris. The right moves on. Up next... On the left, number seven. And on the right is number ten. On the left, we have one by C. Wen. <laughs> what, well, I just I just gave him a little light throw, like a dad tossing his baby in the air and catching him. We have me at the computer looking tired as ever. The Finna Nut Banner, my awful, uh, uh, what does it say? We don't dial 911 thing on the door. George Costanza. I lost a shit ton of balls because of this fucking fish in chat. On the right, we have Earth Serpent. The Bionicle Giga Chad. Will it be the left or the right? How many times has the Bionicle Giga Chad been back to? Something fun I've noticed about these feedback streams is Chris always starts off in such a good mood, and by the end of them, Chris is unbelievably miserable. <laughs> you would be the one to notice. You are editing them, and I believe you. I 100% believe you. The left is crushing again. 21 votes. I'll give it five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. C. Wenz moves on. The left continues on. Which brings us to round two. We have not looked at all of the submissions, but we've looked at a lot of them. We will see duplicates from here on out, however. On the left, we're going to be looking at number 18. Up against number nine. Number 18 was submitted at 1250, can I tell? I don't know who made this. I think it's Blaze. We have me. My skin is very red and my eyes are very gray, of course. With Wigglytuff, a lot of fairy type Pokemon, Mareep, all kinds of Pokemon. Look at this Furret. Look at this Furret. This is great. This is a great drawing. Against number nine by Peter. I believe we've already seen this one. It's the missing Feebas wanted poster. Will it be the left or will it be the right? Start voting now. Tanning out a hand. I'm not. I'm, I'm very light skin color. It's just I wear a white shirt and the camera adjusts and then it thinks that I go from pink to red. It's, I, okay. I, I don't, I don't need to explain myself. Kind of vibe with the right more. The right is a bit of a bit, right? But the left is a nice little drawing here. Still a tough matchup, I think. I get that red at the end of Feebass streams. <laughs> I get that frustrated. We have 20 votes in. The right is in the lead. I'll give it five seconds. Four. Three. It's getting tighter. One. The right by a hair moves on. Just by maybe like a vote or two. Eisen Man Gal, let's go one whole month. That is also your opportunity to uh, uh, say something we will all see for sure. Uh, so you, you can, but you'll have to wait probably another month. Up next... Number four on the left against number 11 on the right. Number four by Decachad. I believe we, I've seen this one many times. Nah, I'd win <laughs> with the stream schedule. Except for this week. This week was a mess. Against Earth Serpent. Have we seen this one? <sighs> Fucking chill, Bill. Is it? Okay, is it the left or is it the right? I... I... Please don't pick the right. I, I know I know it sways you guys when I say I don't want something, but come on, come on. This should this should be an easy one. Come on, come on. Hey, who's voting right? <laughs> I want names. I want names and I want emails. I want yellow pages. Eighty percent of you voting for the left. It is a sweep. Bill and Troyer. <laughs> it is the left. The left is moving on. Absolutely the left. Next, we will be looking at number 12 on the left against number 6 on the right. Number 12 by saving throws. 
It is the original Gooby version drawing. A little less detail, but a big hand holding the game. Against number six. I fear no man, but Feebass scares me. Chat, vote away. Vote away starting right now. Is it going to be the old Gooby version? Or is it going to be Feebass scares me? The left does seem to be in the lead, but not by a lot. 19 votes are in. 20 now. Gooby supremacy. Too bad Tyro's not here. The left does seem to be ahead. I'll give it five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Gooby moves on, which is a shame because there's an updated version, but it moves on. Next, number 13 on the left and number eight on the right. Number 13 by Joe Broski. J Milk. Against Scottage Man. Me killing Chill Bill with just some like great design choices in the background. Just like I like some colors I really like there. Is it gonna be the left or is it gonna be the right, fellas? Vote away. Vote away. It's not my cum. That's disgusting. That's come on. Come on now. Come on now. <laughs> come on. The left and right are tied at 20 votes. That's a problem. That's a that's a big problem for me. It might have to be a coin flip. I'll give it 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 24 votes in. The right moves on. Not by much, though. Not by much. Next, number two on the left and number 20 on the right. I believe number 20 is Gazer. We can just pull this one up right quick. Gazer's drawing with all the stuff in it, Nyoink and all that. Against Aqua Quoka. Chris Piche. Whoops. Versus Chris Pische. A classic meme from the Reddit page. Left or right, fellas? Vote away. Take away his left ball. What happened? <laughs> I missed that one. I missed that one. The right does seem to be ahead by a bit of a landslide here. 17, 19 votes in. 20, 65% of you voting for the right here. I think it's a close. I think there's no coming back. The right moves on. Number 20 continues on. We lock in that vote. MAGM, let's go! MAGM reference! Next, number 17 on the left. What is that? What does that redeem? What does that redeem? Everyone like this stream? You don't have a choice. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I hate to say it. It's, you don't have a choice. SKD on the left. Chris after catching shiny Feebass. Man in a bathtub of popcorn with champagne. Chat ready to torture Chris in the next run. Not a great thing to see today when we're doing Feebass. Up against Doc Breed. You will never find me. Yes. These are both fire. I don't know how this one will fit, but they're both fire. What will it be, chat? Is it going to be the left or is it the right? Vote away. Vote away. Let me see. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? One fits better as a background, but both are funny. How similar I am to the photo? It's because I'm a Chad, bro. It's because I'm a Chad. I'm a skier. I rip the gnar now, and I'm a Chad. <laughs> I love you post it. It gets voted, and you go, you chose correctly. <laughs> Correct choice. <laughs> you picked the right one. It is the right. It is going to be the right. The right moves on. It, it literally chose the right one. Number one, the first submission of the month on the left against number seven on the right. Number seven we've seen before. It's going to be C. Wens. 
Me with all of the stuff in my room, chat, and a fish. Up against Seto Kaiba. Excuse me, Seto Kaiba on the left. Skibbity Pache. Left or right? Will it be Skibbity Pache or will it be the black and white My Room? Look like the guy in the right one. Yes, yes, I see this. I see this. I don't see any votes in. Never mind, it all just jumped right up. The right is taking the lead here. This is an insane picture. This is this is like a fever dream to me. 61% of you voting for the right. That looks like it's about everyone. I will close it right there. The right moves on. Which brings us to our last new submission. Last one we have not seen. Text from your shirt. I, I, I don't know why we keep commenting on the text. This is a normal shirt. It's a cool shirt. All my friends like this shirt. All my homies appreciate this shirt. Number three on the left against number five on the right. Number three by Joe Broski. I believe this is a classic. It is. It was my old Twitter profile picture. Me in a maid costume sucking on a banana while lying on my side with hot dog socks. Up against Fretless. Fish Piché. Born to fish, forced to work. A different hat, but the same logo on the hat. These are both new. Will it be the left or will it be the right, chat? All good, Seto. Enjoy your evening. It starts off as a tie, but the left takes the lead here by 53%. Tight margins. 20 votes in, and the left does seem to be ahead. 22 votes. 24 votes, and I think that might do it. The left is moving on. 62%. The left continues. We have only one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more matchups to go until we have our background. Up next, on the left, we have number nine against number four on the right. Number nine by Peter. It's going to be the wanted poster. Up against Dekachad with the nah, I'd win background. Is it going to be wanted or is it going to be nah, I win? This is a tough, you know what? I need to change the music. I need to change the music. This is a tough matchup. This is actually a tough one, I think. It's sad to lose one of them. The right does seem to be ahead, though. 17 votes are in. 60%-ish of you voting for the right. 59%. I'll leave it open for, let's see, five more seconds. Four, three, two, and one. The right is moving on. Deca Chads moves on. Bringing Deca Chad to the semifinals. Up next, number 12 on the left. One, two, three, that makes 12. Against number eight on the right. That one's too high. Whoops. Why is that up? Hang on. That's not even open. Why is that? What? Where did that come from? That was weird. Either way, number 12 on the left by saving throws against number 20 on the right. Wait, number 20? No, number eight. Number eight, Gooby versus Chris Hub. Chad, is it gonna be the left or is it gonna be the right? Vote now. Teams is invasive, it is. I don't know why Teams is popping up. Don't make no sense, it's not even open. The right does seem to be head by quite a large margin here. At 16 votes, 75% believing in the hub. Believing in the hub. 18 votes in, that might do it. I'll give it five more seconds. Four, three, two, one. It is the right. The right moves on. Truly, the new, the new version does uh, suck. Most Microsoft apps do for some reason. Microsoft Office in general. On the left, our next matchup. Number 20 by Gazer. Against number 15. Which I don't know off the top of my head. Gazer on the left. Doc Breeb on the right. This is a tough one. The New Ink image with all of the shit everywhere. Against you will never find me Chad moment. 
chat, vote. Vote, 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 vote. The right starts off ahead, but I don't know if it'll stay that way. 13 votes are in at 69% voting for the right. But it gets slimmer. 20 votes in. Ooh, I'm going to leave it open 10 more seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. It was close, but Doc Breed moves on. It was close, though. Doc Breed will move on to the semifinals. Finally, in this round, our last matchup, number seven on the left and number three on the right. Number seven by C. Wen. Number three by Joe Broski. It is me in my room with chat and a fish against me on my side sucking down a banana. Will it be the left or right, chat? I'm, I'm ruined! I'm done for! <laughs> the left does start ahead. But it seems to be going down. 11 votes, 13 votes. 14 votes, 16 votes. Mm -hmm. It's not looking close, but there's a lot of votes that are not in. 65% of you going for the left. I will give it 10 more seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. It is going to be the left moving on to the semifinals. That means the, the excuse me, the semifinals begin now. Only three more matchups to make before we pick our final background for the month of February, the shortest month of the year, a leap year. On the left, first off, we are looking at number four against number eight. Number four by Dekachad against number eight by Scottage. Nah, I'd win against Chris Hub, killing kill, uh, Chill Bill. Will it be the left or will it be the right? That is up to you. Vote away now. Now, these things are hard to win, honestly. These are hard votes to win, no matter what you put in. I don't think we've had clean sweeps since, like, the first one we've done. It is pretty tight here. The left is ahead 63%. 61 now to 39 at 19 votes. No, nah, we'd win. 19 votes are in. There is still a handful more of you left who could vote. I'm going to give it five seconds. Four. Three. Two, one. The left moves on to the finals. Nah, I'd win by Dekachad. Blue Kirby, uh, actually, no, you did sweep, so I'll give you that. I'll give you that little comment there. The last semifinal match of the night is going to be number seven. No, excuse me. Number 15 against number seven. Number 15 by Doc Breeb against number 7 by C. Wen. Will it be the left or will it be the right? Vote now. You wanted to lose? That's why you won. That's why you won. You won. If you want to win, it's, it's more likely. Look, you got to understand the psychology of chat. This is how I run things here. Thank you, Brandy. Appreciate you. The left is in the lead. 60% of you thinking it should be the left on 16 votes. I will leave it open for another 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Fellas, it's a coin flip. It's a coin flip. We haven't done that in a while. Look, I hate doing the coin flips. The coin flips feel really bad. But I'll tell you what. If it's heads, we will go with the left. If it is tails, we will go with the right. What will it be? Tails! 
which means unfortunately for Doc Breed, but as fate has it, best two out of three. No, 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 we haven't done that before. As fate has it, C. Wen moves on. The right continues to the finals. But fellas, 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 fellas. That brings us to our final matchup of the evening. Everyone like this stream. Our final matchup of the evening includes number seven by C. Wen. Up against number four by Deca Chad. Is that a water? God fucking. Mm. Number four by Deca Chad. It all comes down to this. Soak it in. Soak it in. Get a good look. Because these are your two options. Nice car. Whoever wins this one gets the background chat. Will it be the one on the left? Or will it be the one on the right? Begin voting now. What is, what is with all the fucking sounds? The left is starting off in the lead. 17 votes are in. 18. 61% of you voting for Dekachad. 20 votes. 21. And it is tight. Look, because of how tight it is, I'm going to have to give it 10 seconds. 10. 9. 8. 7. 6. Five, four, three, two, and one. Fellas, the winner of tonight's background contest for the month, the entire month of February, is Dekachad. Dekachad, congratulations, you are this month's winner. With nah, I'd win. And me holding a Feebas with a Colgate hat. Congratulations. It's pretty fire. It's a pretty fire background. It is my worst enemy right here. But it's a pretty fire background. Gotta play the Digi... Uh, I did get a Digi Redo Redeem. When's the next contest open? We'll do it right now. I'll set it up right now for you. How does that sound? Our next contest will open up this very moment. Let me just make a, a quick duplicate. Make a quick duplicate of the uh, 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 form. What is it? March? That's a scary month. March background contest. That means we're creeping up to one year on the channel. That's creepy. I don't love that. All right. All right, all right, all right. The link to the new one is going to be in chat right here. Submissions will close. When we do the next background contest stream, if there's a, a mod in the chat that would like to post that into forms in the Discord, I would appreciate that greatly. You are also welcome to resubmit. You are more than welcome to resubmit a background that you have done in the past. There is no issue there. Just please don't spam it. Please don't spam the background contest. Those ones suck. Those ones stink when it's all spam. Anyways... Anyways, 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 chat. Can't copy the link? That's annoying. Let me put it in forms then. Alright, it's in the Discord for everyone. I did it. I took care of it. Anyways. We have a fish to catch. Here's my thinking for today. Why do we want to be a goat? Mentally ready to waste seven hours. Look, it's not a waste. It's an attempt. 
It's a try. I'm thinking we have our custom controller here. I want to make this fast though. So here's my thinking. We get to the Feebas fishing tile, and then I'm happy to use the controller. But until we get to a fishing tile, we use a normal controller. Does that sound fair to you, chat? Does that sound like a fair proposition so we don't waste too much time with me just figuring out controls and struggling? You're insane. <laughs> I'm not insane. I'm normal and I'm cool. I'm very... They told me, they told me in Bartlett today that I'm very chill. Sounds bad. Look, that's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do because it's going to uh, make things... But we had su such few encounters last time. Alarok gets to decide? Fine, Alarok, what do you think? What do you think? Do we wait until Feebas to reel it in? Or do I have to do it the whole time? You're buying 20 Feebas right as I start. Great. No, that's good. It's really good. Thanks for that. That's only good. Oy vey. Save your wrist only when you find Feebas. Deal. I've been skiing all day anyways. My arms are already tired going into it. If that's the case, then I'm going to do one thing. I'm going to put the link to crowd control into the chat. Actually, I'm going to do two things. I'm going to change the name of stream to... To Feebas. I'm going to put the link to crowd control into the chat. I'm going to pin this link. Thank you for sharing it, uh, Joe Broski. I would have pinned that one if I saw it sooner. And we're going to catch this stupid fucking purple fish. All right. That's the game plan. Let's get started. What? Why is this looking goofy? Oh, wait, you know what I need? I need one more thing. Oh, shit. <laughs> right away. Great, right away. Let's start the timer. And we're moving. We're in the game. Fucking two Feebass right off rip. Two Feebass already? Imagine... Look, 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 look. If this Feebas is shiny, this first one, I will eat poop ice cream on stream. Okay, good. Good. What is... Whoa! <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Hang on, let me look at the other one first. Wait, I didn't mean shift! Imagine that was shiny. Yeah, the colors went crazy. Okay, we have no balls. We have no use for this thing. <laughs> this is super shiny. Imagine if we got that Feebas. We'd have an even rarer one. Yeah, that was weird. That was very weird. That was very, uh... That caught me very off guard. Alright, we know the deal. We need to get to Fortree, preferably. We need to get Surf and we need to get a badge. Technically the challenge wouldn't be over because that's not shiny. Technically true. Technically true. That is just a fucked up Pokemon. Instant teleport to Moss Deep. That is not useful. That is not useful for me. That gives me a super rod if I want it, but I already have an old rod and that's more efficient. That is so much more efficient. So much more efficient. I wonder, like, it didn't pull in... Uh, Omastar's palette. I wonder what palette it was pulling in. Because it was all green and red and blue. I don't know what palette it was pulling in. Maybe it was the background for the battle or something. Or maybe the HUD. I don't know. It pulled in something weird. Alright, we also know that we would prefer May to have Combuskin because there's just so much more water Pokemon in this game. And if we catch a good water Pokemon, we'll be all set for that battle. So let's get Trico. And unfortunately, someone is going to be named after Feebas. I'll tell you what. If you want to be Feebas, I don't know why you would. Start typing in the chat now. Shit. 
Can Ham do it? Can Ham take care of it? Nah. Well, then you're typing in the chat, so now your odds are going up, you dummy. <laughs> You want this? Shell, you would like this. This actually would be good for you. The beef ass. Sure, why not? We're getting closer. We're almost there. We're almost to it. Let me make sure mods are eligible. You can't stop. But if you don't want it, then stop. Stop typing. Who's going to be the level 5 feeb ass? It is going to be... Shell! <laughs> Shell, you got it! Shell is Feebass. Dub. Dub. Look, it was Nightbot. It's not rigged. I have no way of rigging Nightmod. Nightbot. Fucking... I I'm actually stuck. I'm I don't have teleport. I'm actually stuck. Wait, idea. Idea form in brain. Maybe there's a PC at one of these battle faci- Okay. Better than nothing. I was about to fix it. Oh. Oh, we're fine. Okay. You, you're level 10. That's great. You're going to go right here. Oh, okay. Uh, not so good, but still good. Uh, you can go away forever. Do we have anything else in here? Okay, no, we're fine. Okay, okay, we're chilling. We don't have a badge. Do we have surf anyways? We don't, we have a repeat ball, great. So here's what I'm gonna do in that case. I'm gonna attempt the gym. You gave me an Abra? I got an Alkazam. What the fuck? You did this? You're just giving yourself more editing work. Well, chat crashed the game. That counts as a chat reset. Fucking God damn it. Pretty, it's two colors. It's black and white and in the middle. Another cracking W. Don't give him this. Don't give him this. That is crazy. How long did it take for that crash to happen? Was that five minutes? It was five minutes. It was almost six minutes. Second chat game crash. It might be the third. It might even be the third. You gotta be fucking kidding me with that. All right, so uh, don't... Please don't put battles in when I'm at the mark. Don't, please don't do that. <laughs> if EOS popped off too, I would probably be at my angriest. I would be very angry. Okay, we got uh, Shawl, Shawl, the deli bird. I hope it's uh, shiny. It's got a nugget, which is really good. Maybe Shell's helping us now. Change the name. Bilk. Is this a shiny Carvana? <laughs> that is so close to what we want to catch. Give me this. Do you know what's crazy about this? The way the odds work when it comes to getting a Feebas. Okay. Okay, that got canceled. Interesting. The way the odds work is the shiny roll is always for the Pokemon you're trying to catch with the fishing rod, not Feebas. The frame is counted on Carvana if you're using a super rod. If you wanted to RNG manipulate Feebas, you'd have to do it trying to manipulate Carvana or Magikarp or Tentacool. And then it does a 50-50 and says, is it a Feebas? Are you on the tile? Is it? A, if you are, is it a 50-50? But the frame is the same. Which is really weird. It's like a whole different role outside of the Pokemon encounter thing to get a Feebas. But it ends up being 50-50. And it's a shiny Feebas, it counts, right? Not particularly. 
If I can't tell, if it's a legit shiny Feebas because it's on the tile, I can't tell. There's no way for me to know. But like, if you did it right here, then I'd reset. Okay. We get, not you, we get you, and we're gonna rename Bilk. What do you mean by milkable? Okay, Bilk. If you want to be a spiel that maybe we'll use if we actually get Surf, start typing in the chat. Shell is ineligible, as he got the, uh, the Feebass last time. Calls her daughter three times in one. Calls her, her our daughter. Wait, why is that fishy? Why is that weird to be like, that's my daughter? Seems like it's not fishy. Bilk is a real word? It's definitely not in the Webster's Dictionary. It's definitely not there. Ball milk. Boy milk. It's boy milk. I can't do anything about it. If it comes back, it comes back. And it's your fault, Blue Kirby. Who's it gonna be? Who's gonna replace Bilk? It is Light Gem. Light Gem, you are the new Spiel. Congratulations to you. You might be useful for a short period of time. Light Gem, congrats. Needs to cheat someone to bilk? Is that a real thing? These words were in the Bible. <laughs> Every one of these. Bilk recurs, shall, sleets, octets, and cottage. Can someone make a sentence with all of those? Like, oh, I do recur. It was sleeting outside, and I thought to myself, I shall join my octet with a bit of bilking. When I got my bilk out, it looked like cottage cheese. The end. That was in the Bible. He's going on my hit list. It, it does that on purpose, uh, Shao. That is purposeful. Also, is this shiny? No, that's unfortunate. But we do love our mercury wormples. I think Claydol has teleport, right? All right, we're set up then pretty good. Also, I see someone has inverted the controls and also given us a badge. Do we have Surf? Absolutely goaded. We can move on. We can get there much faster now. Shit, my controls are backwards. I need... Don't need to go here. Thank you. Thank you for that, though. I need to go get balls and try to get a tentacle. Wait, where would the boat have brought me? Would that have brought me to Lily Cove? If, no, I don't think he lets me go. I don't think he does because I don't have the thing. Shit, I have to beat May. Southern Island is unfortunately not Mewtwo. It's unuseful unless you have the right uh, a, a flag set. Doesn't do anything. Let's put uh, Sleets in the front. We're going to give Sleets Surf, and it should be able to just kick May's ass, and then we can get Pokeballs. You want to help get it over with? It has been since, like, November. <laughs> October or November. It's been a long run. We actually are passing the Frozen run officially today. 60 hours is a guaranteed longer than the Frozen run in and out of stream. And it's going to be our longest run today. Was your Pika Blue pills? We'd have to get to Mobville to get Pika Blue. Who won the background contest? Dekachad was the winner. It is insane. It is insane that I'm actually just doing something longer than playing Pokemon when I'm permanently frozen. When I can't ever do anything. It's crazy. Bilk is to cheat someone out of money. I bilk you! I bilk you, dumbass! Take it. Take my bilking. Oh, that's a note from HR. Anyways. I'm going to go up here. I'm going to get my Pokedex. We're going to go back using teleport. Big brain. And we are going to get Pokeballs. And we're going to get a tentacle. And we're going to go back towards Maville. We're going to kick May's ass again. And we're going to start fishing. If they've seen your stream, you're fired. That's also a nightmare of mine. Being a sub-teacher and being called Luddy or Bilk. 
Well, I don't know if that guy was a substitute teacher, first of all, but um, probably Bilk. If you didn't know, like, like if somebody was like, I'm going to call this old man my favorite streamer's nickname. They don't know what that means. That's not a problem. But Bilk is going to cause snickering. That's going to cause people making fun of you. Yeah, Luddy's at least a nickname. Bilk is Bilk. <laughs> you don't want to be Bilk. Imagine your name's William or Bill and they call you Bilk. <laughs> That's not good. I, I don't think any Pokemon are hot. Don't think anything of that. Why did I use teleport like I said I would? That would have sped that up a lot. Okay, no encounters there. Good. Let's do 14. How long do you think the run would last? I didn't think about it. I hadn't thought about it. I was hoping I'd have some plot armor, to be honest with you, but I have not. It's, I've had no plot armor. I've had no main character energy for these streams. Zero. Even when I got the Zigzagoon, truly zero. I don't, I'm, not, I'm not answering those questions. The specific blue ball name or not? I need one higher level than that. This is what we're going to do. We're going to get a smoke ball. We're going to give it to our good old-fashioned Cradoli. We're going to put it in the front because we're going to be using it for fishing anyways. And we're going to go until we find a very high level tentacle, like level 30 something. Shouldn't take very long. That is not the one. We kind of are. You'll have plot armor and reset 43. Look, if you're right, Ramsey, if you're right, I will donate 100 members. If run 43 gives us Feebas today, I will give you 100 members. I will donate 100. And I won't regret it. I'll be happy. I'll be stoked. I'll be extremely happy if that's the case. Ooh, do I take this win goal? We take this win goal. We throw a safari ball at the win goal. 100k balls? Okay, you'll get both. Why did you kill Kray? <laughs> Piece of shit. Who's gonna be a bird? It's gonna be a dumb, stupid bird. It's a veer, you're a bird. Congrats. You killed my whole team? Fine. Fine. Don't freeze the game. Don't crash the game. <sighs> okay. Uh, I think as we teleported, I think if I quit the menu, it would have crashed the game. I think as teleport happened, it saved us. Whew. A cloister and a Mewtwo. Shell, you're, you're definitely going to PC. We have a new bird. But you can join us. You can go right fucking here, buddy. Still got the wind goal. That means chat can't screw you over. Here's the thing. If I didn't catch it with that Savari ball, it would have whited out. It would have been a whiteout. It would have reached the point in the script where that can happen. So I have to catch it in a ball. I have to be quicker than chat and potentially have a master ball to win. If I don't, if I don't catch the Feebas in one ball and you guys faint it or faint me, then it goes away. If you need anything, just ask you at 14k. I appreciate it. I think we're good to go, though. I think we have everything we need. If you lose win goal now, what happens? Uh, I have a very bad time against May and probably have to go back to Oldale. Wind goal is only for May. Actually, can we teach wind goal surf? Bro looks like an aqua. Is the drought annoying you? It's actually really bad for this battle, but fine. I, I can work with a flying type. It's fine. When I was 14... I put a MIDI of this song into GarageBand and exported it. Oh, thank you. Exported as a new version that I re uh, instru edit instruments for. And I told my teacher that I wrote it, that I made up this song and I wrote it. She was like, ah, oh, good. 
I think wing attack probably does more actually. Even with the rain. You gave me a purple ball. Thank you. That's useful. Thank you. I always get nervous about going to the pond. I always get very nervous about that because the pond never seems to have Feebas. It's very rare. Plagiarism moments. Look, the only person who heard that was my teacher. It's fine. It wasn't even my music teacher. It was like my English teacher. She's like, cool. Wow. <laughs> and then I put a big smile on my face and went, hee 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 hee, I lied. I'm a liar. A silly little fella in your box. Is, if it's a Feebas, then it's not silly and it's not little. It's a piece of shit. It's a piece and of shit. I spilled that on my face. I spilled it on my face. Don't get electrocuted. Each bomber guy's gonna get you. Look, it's fine. My teacher won't snitch. She was chill. She was cool. Can you tell me how Gatsby dies? I never read that book. Never read that book. Never watched that movie. Great Gatsby. The only book I think I read for, like, English classes or, like, humanities classes was 1984 because it was the only one I was interested in. None of the other ones were interested in me. None of the other ones. Oh, Oedipus? Don't care. Hamlet? Don't give a fuck. Of Mice and Men? Don't really care. But 1984, that's a good book. What's the redeem for Nice Cock? I think it's like Wii Sports or something. Is it just Nice Cock? Am I wrong? Am I wrong about the cock and it's nice? <laughs> Thanks. Been waiting for that. Imagine not liking oh, Hamlet. Nice cock. I'm not saying they're bad books. I just didn't care. That is actually sick. This is actually sick. This is so useful. It won't obey me, but it's so useful. If I get in trouble. Three? Oh, okay, that was the silly little fella. That was your silly little fella? That was from Shao. Shao, you're killing me. You're killing me. You're killing me today. Three Feebasses. <sighs> nice car. I'll tell you what. Ramsey, this is your shot for 100k balls, 100,000 balls to you and a hundred members in the chat. This run has to be a success. It must be a success. The number for chat resets. Ramsey thinks it's this one. Adding more time to his sentence. Look, he's trying to squeeze the cash out of me is what he's doing here. He's like, hmm, I know how this works. <laughs> kind of smart. Kind of smart on his end. More work to do, that sucks, but more cash is good. 135? Don't give him anything and you get balls. Ramsey will get balls. Chat will get memberships. <laughs> Alarok, thank you. Thank you. I'll see if the TTS could handle that one. 220? Ah, my mom's trying to talk to me. Look at my party. What the fuck? We got a crazy party. Anger the Pelipper. We can't catch this. So here's what I'm going to do. If it doesn't explode, then this is a good run. Good. Wait, it does mean spin wheel twice. That is what it means. Shit. Okay, we're gonna spin a wheel twice. Oh, fuck. Nice, <laughs> <car>. <laughs> this, 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 
This is pain. This is just pain. This is just painful. All right, chat. Let me show you the wheel. Let me show you the wheel as we do. Because there was two redeemed. Let's move ourselves back and look proper and gentlemanlike here. There we go. Because there was two redeems. Not redeems. Two submissions that were both worth $5. I believe Phoebus. Thank you. I'm going to spin twice. The two numbers we spin on is who we're getting rid of in the party. This is this is one of the worst starts to Phoebus of all time. <laughs> number two. Pokemon number two. Please tell me that's not Cray Dilly. And Pokemon number four. Pokemon number two and Pokemon number four. Which one are these? No! No! It's the two best ones! Except for Curlia. God damn it! Okay, so we lose Cradilly, our suction cups Pokemon, and we lose Rayquaza, our strong. What is my mom doing? Well, as soon as I get to the PC, they're gone. What happens if I teleport home? Does it fuck up the game? <laughs> I hope I have some Pokemon in my PC. <laughs> I hope, or that's a dead run. <laughs> the, the run is over if I don't have Pokemon in my PC. <laughs> it's a game over. I have no Pokemon. I can't do anything. I, I can't even get rid of them until after I get the starter. Actually, wait, no, saved. Saved. We're getting a starter. We have to get a starter before we go to the PC. So saved. Saved. We're fine. You give me a backup dilly, then we're good. We're chilling. Might as well just off the rest of them. <laughs> Imagine if you didn't send me to that island. This is fine. If you didn't send me to that island, I have to get rid of the mail. You could have sent me to a PC ahead of Little Root Town. So I had to get rid of the Pokemon, not get the starter, and could have fucked me. Could have made the run end. You could have done that. Oh, you give them the middle finger? I don't want to do that. This is at my own accord. This all happened because of me. This is my own fault. Ramsey, I sure hope you're right. I am down to lose $200 if you're right. I am okay with that. I am ready to part ways with it. Why are more appearing? What is happening? What is happening? How did we get anger back? How did how is it the same name? Ah! Nice cost. This is this is the worst start. This is the worst start. This is the worst start. This is horrible. This is horrible. I quit. <laughs> you guys just lost 100 members. Oh my god. <laughs> That's three resets. We, we haven't left fucking Little Root Town. And that's three resets. <laughs> that's true. That's true. That's a lot of coin. Oh my god. Oh my days. And we got a Pelipper. We got the same exact Pelipper. With the same name twice at the same level. <laughs> you need to get that out of your system. Oh man. Oh man. That is god-awful. That is fucking god-awful.
on that dilly. That is also god awful. We got a new one. We got a new one. We're still in this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the door didn't even open for the truck. Okay. Can I outrun a Stantler? My controls are inverted. Okay, the door's open. If this is shiny, I'll cry. I'll cry on stream. We're fine. If this is shiny, I'll donate five members. Okay. If this is shiny, I don't. I don't know. I. I. I'm at a loss for words. I'm at an absolute loss for words. <laughs> Ugh. Stream started so good too. It started so good. Now we're here. Okay. Nothing fishy is happening right now. You are not allowed to specify IVs. I don't know how the IVs work. Uh, hi, Ryu. Hear you. Hi, Ryu. Hi, hi, the Dragonite. A cursed box? From, from what just happened, or is there a new cursed box? What, do you do this to yourself? Because nobody else will do it, damn it. Nobody else will have the cojones to stand up. And stand tall and say, I'm going to shiny hunt a Feebass, but make it hell. Nobody will do it. Someone's got to do it. So why not let it be me? Why not let me do it? And have a horrible Friday every Friday. Blur is back? Where's Blur? Where's Blur? Oh, I was like, is there a chat member named Blur? Let's go, Fortree. Blur is back. It's not Bilk. Whew. Our box is fine. Here's the deal. We have an old rod. Good. We haven't even gone fishing yet. We have a smoke ball. Cray Dilly can have the smoke ball. I... Oh, okay. It didn't happen. It didn't happen. <sighs> the bag fixed it. We have the badge for surf. We don't have surf. Do we have a repeat ball? That could be useful for Feebas. Feebas Night Funkin. Nobody else will force themselves to endure torture. From their chat, making fun of them and from experience. Please don't do it. Oh. By experiencing incredible sadness weekly, nobody else will guess I have to. <laughs> this is facts. Somebody's got to do it. All right? I don't think it's very funny. I think it's just real, real shit. A perfect zigzagoon? That would have been cool. No name! Thank you for the five members! Uh, more like goat name. Constantly throw the members. Blue Kirby got one, Cloth got one, Scottage got one, AM Buddy got one, and Pistolin got one. All familiar names. Let's go. Let's double check our PC, because I got a feeling when I checked it, some people might have thought, Oh, now's my chance. Now, 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 now's my time to shine. This is my chance. And I was wrong. Let's go get a Linoon. I don't know what May has. It might be a Grovile. Hopefully this is something good. It is not. Oddish will not help us. I was talking to myself and I said intelligent in a Spanish kind of way because I'm silly. I was thinking, what, uh, what is it actually pronounced in Spanish? I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe Blue Kirby would know. You think Shells looked through enough footage to perform a psychoanalysis of each chat member through their messages? Yes. I do think that. We have Surf. We love to see it. We love to see it. What's the rule? What do you mean the rule? Like the rule on the fee bass? Also, that was a good catch. The rule is if we get a shiny fee bass in our boxes, if Chad sends one, then I have to reset. I'm going to roll for Linoon. Linoon is going to be you. Uh, hear you. I still don't really know how to pronounce your name, and I apologize for that. But it's you. You didn't get a Zigzagoon, but you got a Linoon. So congratulations. Three more random balls. Let me look at them. I don't think they've come in yet. What the fuck? Don't freeze. Did it have to be level four? That would have been so nice at like level 30. <sighs> it's my favorite Pokemon. Intelligante. The G sounds like an H, but I pronounce it with a Y. Intelligente? Intelligenti? 
You know what? I want Warple over Adepter. Fuck you, Adepter. I do not consent. You don't have a choice. You don't have a choice. What did Chris say? <laughs> uh, Spanish, I thought you'd know. Let's see if we can get one more. Let's see if we can get one more and we can kick May's ass. Oh, it has an orange berry. I actually love to see that. Come on, give me one more. Uh, not a Zigzagoon. It has pin missile. Hoenn's most precious war criminal. Why is it a war criminal? What did it do? What did it do? Intelli-Hentai gang. <laughs> a new poster. Let's go. What was the poster? Hey, I need to. I need to manage the stream. I need to manage myself. That helps. I do know of the Epic Mickey games. I've never played them. Don't ask what Zigzagoon did in Albania. I, I won't ask. I won't find out. It's a Pikachu? Let's go. Goated. 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 All right. Let's see if we can get someone else the name for Linoon. Linoon number two. I'm going to throw a repeat ball. That's probably smarter. Or not. Maybe not. Why don't we weaken it? It's not going to kill us. We might not hit it, though. Chins, that's not my name. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Thank you. All right, now throw it. Ask not what Zigzagoon does. Instead, ask what you can do for Zigzagoon. It's very poetic. Pokemon mangas, because Kanto and Hoenn ones are just evil teams committing literal war crimes. I did not know that. I did not know that. That's interesting. That's a lot more interesting, though, literally, than, uh, uh, than like, Team Rocket being like, we're going to take your Pikachu. Blaze, you're the other. Linoon, congratulations to you. All right, we have our two Linoons. That might be enough to just win this battle and get fishing. See if we can do it. Don't faint the Zigzagoon while Wally is trying to catch the Ralts. That's the real war crime. Fuck. It's only one. We're fine. Uh, Wurmple, you gotta go in your beloved box where you live forever. Thank you for your service. Hooray? <laughs> Maxi burns Norman alive in front of his son? What the hell? That's hard as fuck. What? What's your favorite early normal type? Ratata. Easy Ratata. Ratata eradicate absolute goats. What is happening? You got Epic Mickey and you needed alcohols an anonymous. A oh, double A batteries. That sucks though. Starly does count. It's a normal type. Unless it's like only normal. If it's normal monotype, then it doesn't count. Uh, it's probably going to protect turn one. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to headbutt. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to use sand attack. It is keen eye. That was brain dead. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to headbutt. Very on the edge. Are they really edgy comics? Are they extremely edgy? It seems like that's what a lot of people want if you look at the uh, the ROM hack universe. Terrible, terrible place. That makes a lot of sense, though. This would be a terrible, terrible place. It is drawn out in the games and in the cartoons as a very beautiful, fun, silly place. But in fact, if you were in this world, it would not be safe. It would not be pleasant. Oh, so I'm getting wrecked. What the fuck is with the crits? This could end bad. Might need to get a third Pokemon. We should survive this? No, I guess not. That's very bad. I think we're toast. There is an anime uh, logic ROM hack, I'm pretty sure. There's probably several of those. Will you be using the fishing rod controller? Once we get to the Feebas tile, we'll do that. Yeah, we lost this battle. We need a third Pokemon. 
I always like screw this up because sometimes we win with two and sometimes we don't. You'd think I'd have it locked in. But it also depends on what the rival has. Like, most of the time we go for Combusking because we're planning on getting a water type anyways. But we don't have the option now. We don't have that option. Brandy, thank you! Appreciate it. Mega Man 4 has such a good soundtrack. It's such a good soundtrack. I used to love this track in high school. We take those, a level 24 Celebi. We take those and we run with them. If it can land like a confusion or something similar, then we're good. But let's see if we can grab one more Pokemon. Let's see if we can get one more Linoon or Atropius. Perfect. Really got the brick beat out of you, huh? I absolutely did. I absolutely have been getting the shit kicked out of me this stream. We do have a teleport mon. We have uh, Clay Doll. So we're chilling. That being said, we're gonna have to put Blur away. We just teach Surf to Linoon. Scottage! You're the other Linoon. Congrats! Congrats! You're a weasel! You're a weasel! You're a stinky weasel! GV? You're playing Unbound? Unbound is really goaded. It's extremely goaded. A Zatu. Actually, this would be far better. This would be far superior. Let's catch this. Let's just catch it for fun. This is far superior. So much far superior than the other Pokemon we could be using. Against Kabuskin. Please. Yes! This is so good. This is the ultimate matchup. This is an excellent matchup, and it obeys us. This is perfect. Mick! Mick, you are a slow king. I'm gonna call it Slow Mick. Slow Mick. Let's go! Let's go! You were sent to a fantasy of Raichu named Craps. You were sent to a fantasy world with a 2005 Chrysler town and country in your possession. How well off will you be? I would probably be ripped to shreds and called a wizard or a witch. Some kind of evil warlock. Loopadoop, hello. Is anything holding anything I can sell? Not really. Not really. Is there anything in my possession I can sell? Oh, yep. Okay. Yeah, I can work with that. It's enough to get a few balls. Let's give this to Slow Mick. A rum heckler. Raichu had Thunderbolt already? Probably. Raichu's just not going to obey us, though, because we don't have the badges. This is the only badge we have, and this flag doesn't change your, uh... Uh, 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 your tolerance to be obeyed, or whatever that would be called. Obedience. The ones next to it, uh, change your obedience. Okay, um, that doesn't make me a furry, it's a video game. And I didn't put it there. It was snuck into my bag against my well. What? Oh, that was close to freezing the game. That was fucking scary. That was right there. That was almost another reset. That was almost another reset. That was so close. Appreciate it, uh, Doc Breeb. Enjoy Minecraft. Enjoy Minecraft with the beard. Nice car. Okay. All right, let's kick May's ass. If she's going to start with Pelipper, we'll keep uh, our first line in the front. And we'll switch to Slow King whenever that fucking stupid chicken comes out. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not a furry. I'm not a furry. Forced encounter canceling. Look, I got pretty good at it with the fishing. I got pretty good at it with fishing. It's a strat I've had in my back pocket, but I've never had to use it anywhere except fishing. It just causes problems. 
We're just gonna spam headbutt. And when Combustion comes in, we're gonna spam headbutt and die. Of course you get a double protect, of course. And then when Slow Mick must come in, it will come in. Please don't <laughs> I don't want 15 I don't want 15 Feebas! You're taking the money I pay you and feeding it back into the system. You're putting it right back into the system. I'm giving you Magneton. Use it. This is our last battle, though. Look, 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 look. Maybe I'll put it in the party, but if Shell's sending us 15... This could be the end of run 44. All right, Slow King. Do what you do. It shouldn't be able to KO you even with a bulk up. Should not be able to do that. And you burned it. Let's go. Let's go. Two more. Two more? 17? I don't need 17 Feebas. I don't need that. Time for the Mixter. Mixter sounds like it would be uh, another streaming app like Kick. Mick, you should have your own streaming app called uh, Mick, and I would stream on it and do bad things. Use the Magneton, otherwise it will explode. <laughs> great, great. 45, you'll get it. What about 44? We're on 44. Why don't we just get it on 44? <laughs> You're hired. <laughs> Some fee bass. An apocalyptic amount of fee bass. All right, fine. I'll use it. I'll use it. You don't have to threaten me. No, not the OF. Just things that you shouldn't stream. Things you shouldn't stream. It's time to move to kick. Pack it up. That's it. That guy, by the way, that skiing instructor, Luddy, the guy named John that everyone called Luddy. He, uh... <laughs> When I did my one good attempt at skiing, and I was all proud of myself, I was like, yeah, I can ski. It's like, that was your only good one. Pack it up. You're done for the night. <laughs> That's your only good one you're going to get, pal. It's not even like he was like a drill sergeant type of guy. He like came up to me after, and he's like, you know, down the street, they have skiing rentals. And, and oh, fuck. Here you go. Here's hoist. It was like, oh, the ski rental place down the street. My friend runs that one, and then there's a liquor store behind it, and my friend runs that one, too. You should stop at both. It's everything you need. And I'm like, okay, thanks, John. That's crazy. Oh! What is happening today? Two in a row? I haven't even... I haven't even fished. I haven't even gone fishing. I haven't even gone fishing. I haven't even gone to the water. That's four resets. We haven't... We haven't even gone to the water. My poor neighbor. I wonder I wonder if uh, that goes directly to their wall. Let the man fish. Why would you do that to blue? Do what? Do what? You know what? It's, it's because I keep doing shins. Keep it cool, keep it calm and collected. It's fine. It's fine. Everything is good. This is the run. This is the run. This is look at we have a <laughs> We have four wiggly tufts and a Gardevoir. You know what? We take it because that's money. That's money. Try the name Fish? Maybe that's a plan. Maybe that's a plan. That's money. We take those. Those are money. Are any of them shiny? Nope. But of course, the first two fucking Feebas out of the 17 are shiny. The Blaze Train. We love a Blaze Train because it just means cash. 
just means we're making money. Every single one of those is worth $5,000, roughly. Also, I'm going to put you in the front, because these can all keep their names. Half of them are Gable. The burger has mystery sauce on it. What what burger? <laughs> Where where's the burger? <laughs> Send Wiggly Tough to be high dollars. That is a plan. I would not be mad at that. That would not make me upset. I'm not, I'm not a trafficker. That's that's messed up. <laughs> I don't want your burger. If you put a mystery sauce on it and don't explain what the mystery sauce is and that's your advertisement, I don't want the burger. I don't want it. I don't want whatever sauce you're putting on that. I don't trust like that. <laughs> don't say that. Don't say that, please. <laughs> Two Vaporeons to prevent high shiny Feebas rates. I don't know if that's how it works, but thanks. You send something to my PC? I hope it's valuable. Hopefully we can get a strong water type here. Like Slow Mick. The mystery sauce increases your special attack? I really don't want it. If it's filled with calcium, I really don't want that burger. You got a Wurmple plush? Goated! Put a picture of it in the Discord. That's goaded. I don't know what an Ed is, but the sauce smells awful. <laughs> if the Dunsparce is shiny, I'll donate a member. If it's shiny, I'll donate a member. Gardevoir is going to be Seto Kaiba. A bit fitting, if you ask me. Seto, it's you. Congratulations. There's PP Max in it. I'm, I'm going to throw up. I'm sick to my stomach. My belly is sour. AM buddy, welcome. You got a membership today gifted to you. To our from our lovely friend uh no name. Have you seen Good Burger? I did see Good Burger. Good Burger is a great movie. That's an excellent classic bop. Would I eat the Ed sauce? I've no clue. You know what? Yes. Yes I would. We got, we're on our fourth reset today. We haven't even gotten to the water. Let's see what's in the PC. Let's see. Take those www.hpup.com. Let's go. Money, 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 balls. It is not shiny, so we will not be donating a member, but thank you for the craps. I will put it in the party for the sentiment. We do need a Cray Dilly. I'll probably swap out some of these Jigglypuff momentarily. A shiny Vaporeon named Perusing and Perking and Murder. Very nice. Would you like a Feebas? No! <laughs> I do want these HP ups. We'll keep the shiny one. Is it you, Bagel? Bagel's shiny. The murder worm. Alright, we'll take the shiny one of you for Surf. And we'll take Scizor, because I like Scizor. Good. Good, 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 good. How many HP ups did we get? That's a lot of money. Eight. That's... P <coughs> That's great. All right, we need to kick May's ass. I don't think we have Surf yet because we don't have the badge. I can see already, and it's raining. Does Vaporeon get Water Gun, or does it just have, like, Tackle and Sand Attack? Okay, not useful. What's that redeem? Cheers. Oh, thank you for the bless use. Let's kick May's ass. Why did you give me this badge? I mean, they all obey me. That's great. That's the good news. But that is so much less valuable to me than the other badge. So much less valuable. Level 15. That makes a lot of sense. 
it's not that likely you get a level 5 uh, Vaporeon. Possible, very possible, but not all that likely uh, in a normal run. Oh. Okay. We do this, we sell our HP ups, we get loaded up with some Pokeballs. Hopefully we get Surf, but who knows. If we do, we get Tentacool or Windle. If we don't, then we uh, we move on and we go to Rustboro. Hang on, there's a, there's a dog barking. Do you hear that? Sorry about that, guys. Was there a Didgeridoo redeem? I can't see what's on my screen right now. I, I, it would help if it was in the chat. Also, Joe Broski, can you please set that back to one like I wanted? <laughs> a ride mon? Okay, wait, let's not talk about the ways you can ride Vaporeon. I don't, I don't think we need to talk about that in today's stream. <laughs> How did a dog get into my room? <laughs> Your hotel room. Remember when you put the didgeridoo back and I said, can we please do one? And you went, no, infinity. And I went, no, one. And you went, well, ten. And I went, no, one. And you went, eh, five. <laughs> okay. Okay, I gotta, I gotta keep my cool. I gotta keep my cool. Pretty slick. You, you don't, we don't gotta talk about it. We don't gotta describe it. That's fucked up. Like you're missing the, you're missing the point. I, uh, I can, but it halts stream. It, ha it holds the stream up for me to do it. I haven't been home. Okay, all right, we can get pokeballs. Do we have Surf? We don't have the badge anyways. Oh, good. We have an Acro Bike. Still need balls anyways. Give me every permission. <laughs> All good. All good, Joe Broski. I do need to edit your permissions in Streamlabs, Blaze, but not every permission. Nobody gets every permission but me. But you do need more permissions. Okay, we're not talking about Vaporeon's butthole. There's a there's a zero need to talk about Vaporeon's butthole. You are legally obligated to bunny hop on the bike. There, I did it. Give us the stream key or else. That's a nightmare waiting to happen. Okay, we're fine. Hordes and towards we take. You know what? Uh, Dunsparce is near and dear to me. Scizor is as well, but Dunsparce is funnier. Vaporeon's not bad. It could be the run. Could be the run. Could be. Call it a bussy. <laughs> Why? Why are we doing this? Why are we doing this? You know, I'd, I, if anyone wants to do that little surf redeem in the in the in the good old fashioned crowd control there, wow, that would speed things up. But you know, I'll play the game as normal. Why are we talking this way about Vaporeon? You get zero coins. That is tough. That is tough to see. Oh, why don't I just put, like, Mewtwo or Rayquaza in the front? Everything obeys me. Everything obeys me this run. We have the final badge. You don't have balls? We all lost our coins because we did four bad runs in a row. This is terrible to see. This is terrible. Where is Bagel? Bagel had to be put to the side for the Dunsparce. So we could hold on to Dunsparce and have a strong Pokemon. I got Surf! I can't use it, though. I don't have the badge. But it, it does make Vaporeon much better, especially in the rain. In fact, it's better than Mewtwo right now at level 7.
I don't have a balance badge. I have a balance badge. All right, we can play. We can play. We can play. We can go to Mobville. We can get a good water type and go to Mobville. This will work. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, how many balls? We have plenty. This will work. This will work, damn it. This could be the run. Okay, uh, do I have a smoke ball? I do. Let's put Cradilly in the front and go until we get something really nice, like a level 35 tentacle. Internet personalities are a part of you? Otherwise, they wouldn't be fun. This will work. This will work. This will do the job. A master ball we love to see. Thank you, AM buddy. Thank you. That's huge. Also, the catches have been crazy today. Tentacool! Gonna kick May's ass. It is Cloth. Cloth, you're gonna kick May's ass today. Congratulations. Cloth. What is that redeem? God fucking. I I'm being driven nuts today. I'm being driven nutty today. Okay. My request has been answered. Thank you, Joe Broski. Thank you. Whew. That puts a lot of stress off my back. Okay. We got another Dunsparce. What level is that Dunsparce, by the way? It's probably low level. Yeah. That's fine. That'll work. Thank you for the second Dunsparce. Goated. It is the exact same level. It's the same exact Dunsparce, basically. Uh, sure. Okay. Tentacool should be able to get us... Did I jump scare you? Yes! Yeah, I bet I did. You coward. You make me sick. Your weakness is pathetic. Good. Tentacool will be able to get us to the water. I'm pokey clicking while watching you. I hope you get a good score. A good score by the time you stop. Why? Okay. Okay. No, I'm in my happy place. I'm in my happy place. I'm zen. I'm zen right now. I'm zen, and I'm gonna do it today. Today's the last day of doing this stupid run. I'm gonna catch it with a fishing rod. What was that? Why was there a thing? Get mildly inconvenienced. What if you had two Dunspars? I love the idea. I gotta conserve the party space, though. We gotta do this right if we're gonna do it. But I do love that idea. Yes! Yes! Okay. No new fee pass, please. Good. Good. Cloth will be nice here, but we have to be Pelipper. So what we're going to need is either a new Chapmon or we're going to need a Linoon or two. The more you react. <laughs> Look, I have to react. It's like my job on here. It's like my whole job. It's my whole biz. Is have hair and react. Those are my two things. Look, Dunsparce, I don't know if it could beat May, but it probably has Serene Grace, and that's useful. You send him on. Don't let it be Feebas. Please don't let it be Feebas. Don't let it be Feebas. Don't let it be Feebas. I, I have hair. I have hair. <laughs> this is not going to do anything.
lose it. I'm gonna fucking lose it. I'm gonna fucking lose it. That is not a good thing. This is not a good thing to guarantee crashes. <sighs> Run 46. Not a single encounter and it is 9.30 in the evening. My name is Chris. This is my goddamn story. Right away. If this, if this, if this first guises is shiny, I might break something. <laughs> okay. Okay. A pink Sneasel. A normal Feebas. Great Dilly. Alakazam. Okay. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> oh, it's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're going to do the shiny Silcoon challenge. <laughs> Never again. Never again are we going to do that. You know what? I'm putting the shiny Sneasel in the front. We'll name this. We'll nickname this. There are two more. Oh. A Voltorb. You beseech me to use it. We have the balance badge. We might have Surf. I don't want to give it to a Feebas. Do not care for that plan. We do have Surf. We do have an old rod. We're in Fortree. We take those. We won't be nicknaming Sneasel. We skipped it. Okay, we're fine. I'll put your 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 Voltorb uh uh named White into here. Why is that acting goofy? I feel like there's something else in the PC. Is there? No, we're good. We have a timer ball. That's kind of useful. We don't have anything we can sell, but we can get five great balls. Frank, we can actually fish this run. This is this is one of our worst fishing days we've had ever. For me, maybe not for Chad, just for me. We need Pokemon that can beat May. Maybe save here? No, we have to do this the right way. We have to do it the right way. Please just catch this. Please make it fast. Ten luxury balls, we take those. It's my favorite Pokeball. Okay. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. I'm in this. I'm cool, I'm calm, I'm collected. I'm good. I'm chilling. We're gonna put guises in here and hopefully it kills it. Because I don't like it. I don't want a Feebas. I want my Feebas. And, okay, it dies. It doesn't die. A master ball. Goaded. Thoughts on low punny? It's a dumb rabbit. It's a dumb, stupid rabbit. Stupid, dumb, dumbass fucking rabbit. Corvus, hello. Welcome. Tax the rich. Use the Master Ball? What if I need it for the Purple Feebas? Fuck. Fuck. How could you say that? Because it's a dumb, stupid, dumbass rabbit. Is it a strong Pokemon? It's pretty strong. It's not that great, but it's pretty strong. Two Master Balls. Okay, I can catch it. I can catch it with that. This is loud. That wasted... 
fucking ten balls. Took ten balls to catch that Linoon. Megalopunny is very strong. What's this background contest? Every month, the new one for March just opened. Every month, we do a background contest where you guys can submit your art. And it will be picked for the channel's background for the entire month. It has to follow YouTube's terms of service. And if you do something still awful, even if it follows the terms of service, your name's attached to it. We just did this month. Also, Gazer, you were the line dude. This guy hates rabbits. Look, I spent the day on the bunny hill today learning to ski, and it didn't get me anywhere thanks to an old fucker. So now I hate rabbits. I hate bunnies, I hate rabbits. Milk is getting resubmitted. Great. No, uh, yeah, good. Good idea. <laughs> it's a great idea. Do you have anything we can sell? We have a smoke ball. I need another uh, Linoon for sure. I need at least two, maybe three. But now I can catch it easier. God, you were great. How could you hate rabbits, Chris? I'll catch you. <laughs> My dad's a rabbit, Chris. I'll get you for that. Can you make it anonymous? Uh, no, you cannot because we need to tie your name to your work. You cannot do it anonymously. That is one of the rules. Is It has to have your name tied to it. No, no, no. You need your name up just like everyone else. Who will be this Linoon? This Linoon that likes me. It's Peter. Peter, you were the Linoon. You know, Shao was right. I just want to mention... Shao was right much earlier in the stream, where at the beginning of these streams, I am, like, happy-go-lucky and all excited, and then at least, like, halfway through, halfway through the Feebass stream, I am a nightmare person. Eight? <laughs> no. Seven today, baby. We haven't even tried fishing. Oh, this is the best. This is the best. Don't I deserve all the permissions? Nobody does. Don't have a mental breakdown on stream. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. My name is Chris. Chris. <laughs> we love Pokemon, true. True, 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 true. Until he finds the tile. I don't know if that'll work. We do have a Mewtwo, though, named Meager. Great Dilly, Narc, Ascot, Blur. Is there anything shiny? No. Your name doth chins. Maybe it's not Chins. <laughs> Kazoo version? No, you want to know what I feel like right now? You want to know what's going through my brain right now? There is nothing going through my brain except this. <laughs> Thank you, Peter. If chat lets him fish, I will request Jirachi percent with the fishing rod in chat. We could learn to do that. We could learn to speed run it with the fee with the fishing rod. Feebass Sephiroth. We have Shalaroth.
Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. No Feebas in sight yet. Zero Feebas in sight. You're just watching the Final Fantasy VII collab on Newgrounds? A goaded collab? I made the credits music? The best version of One Winged Angel, the Kahoot version. <laughs> Okay, which badge you the only the only badge we need is the balance badge. This is the only one we truly need. Every bind to the reel in a specific order so you can furiously spin the reel and get through the game. Would that work? I don't think that would work. Who wants to be mute to start typing in the chat? This run took me three months. No, I still want to do it like it's a story, like a storybook. Who wouldn't? It is built like Ice Spice. Alarok, you are Mewtwo. Congratulations. Please, Nightbot, please. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready to fish. Ready to fish. What do we have in our bag? We have a smoke ball. We give it to Cradley. Good. We have no balls. No HMs. But an old rod for sure. We have not gotten to the spot today. We have fought May. We beat May and then the run reset. We have not gotten to the spot. Do we have any items to sell? Not in our party, really. Will we have anything in the PC that isn't Feebass? I harbor a lot of angst towards my creator. <laughs> this is a crazy sentence. Shiny Latios is sick, and its name is Mean. That ain't bad. Blur, you're going away because we have Octillery. I want to put that shiny Latios in the front. That's cool. That's a cool Pokemon. Your lucky charm? I hope so, no name. I hope so. Mean the orange Latios. Okay, we have a balance badge I see, which is likely means that Chad is giving me Surf, which is really good. It means we just need balls after we beat May. I probably could have just gone with Octillery and made this fast. <laughs> this is fucked. It's just random. <laughs> just random damage. Come on, Lucky Mean. Come on. Don't get crit. Get some good rando damage. Don't lose. Oh, Mean. Oh, Mean. What happened? What happened? We need Guzzlord. Why'd you not give him Feebas instead? I'm going crazy. <laughs> I'm going crazy. Okay. I'm going to lose my mind. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Let's heal our lucky charm. I can't believe it only knows Psywave. That's so weird. It's because Psywave literally does random damage. It's completely random. You found a shiny Romer Latias? That's goaded. That's goaded. Do you know what's a cool thing in uh, Emerald? In Emerald, you can use the Romer to your advantage and do a glitch. Where you can catch any Pokemon you want in the Battle Frontier. I think in the Battle Tower, to be specific. And there are odds that you can get, like, shiny Pokemon in there, and there's a way to get shiny Melodic. Would that count? If I just went to the Battle Frontier and got the shiny Melodic through that glitch, I'd have to beat the game to do it? 
Would that count? No, no, it wouldn't. Whoa, okay, we're in forgery. Okay, we're fine. You got really stoned and make a song? It'll be in my DMs. That's scary and cool at the same time. Yeah, it's not a fee bass. And it's not a fished fee bass for fishermen. Chris may end up looking like Mitsunari Tokugawa. You think if I see another fee bass, you think if another shiny fee bass goes into my PC, I'm going to look like this. This guy. <laughs> okay, that's fair. That's very fair. I'll give you that. That's fair. <laughs> that's pretty fair. I, I can't hold that against you. They already look the same. What do you mean? More accurate hair. This is the only day we shouldn't bully Chris. He can only have so much stamina in a day. He warned us with his shirt. <laughs> look, true. Remember this as you continue to send me feebas and you continue to make fun of me for my hair. Just don't forget. Don't forget. A rap with all the Chris Pichet names. Chins. Swish. Piss. Chris. Okay, why don't we do this? Uh, because I'm probably not going to be able to run away from this thing and I'm probably going to lose because I wasn't thinking. Let's put Cray Dilly in the front. Open up your own bank. That's evil. That's an evil thing to do. Chins Hollywood. They want you to. Do you mean like a sper- Wait, did you mean like a sperm bank? How did we run away? That's messed up. That's messed up, Luke Kirby. If I were a chat member, I would put the gentleman in moat. Can Lottie Oss learn surf? It can. So can Octillery. So we can surf. We just need to beat May. May is our, uh, our our gate. So we need to get Linoons. I'm tired, man. <laughs> Me too, Blue Kirby. Your shadow banned from the chat? I can see you right now, Kai. What were you writing? I can see you right here. You have to be banned to be completely shadow banned, and I don't believe you're banned, Kai. Especially since I can see you right now. I sentence you to the gentleman corner. To the ungentlemanly corner of the room. This will work, we can use this. Half of your messages disappear. It's probably YouTube just saying, uh, something you're putting in there isn't appropriate. It could even just be a swear sometimes. You released your album called 20s 70 years ago. Back when music just started taking off. When did I release 20s? In 2021? <laughs> Look, Shao, you were right. You were, I'll give it to you. You were right, okay, pal? You were right. Six resets. Right? Six resets and no fishing makes Chris an unhappy boy. And no Tropius caught on this great ball makes me unhappy boy. YouTube does hate that word, Kai. Okay, Chris is a happy boy. Who's going to be a dinosaur? Joe Broski, you are a dinosaur, you old fart. The word green was banned? Whoops. I almost wrote chins. Why was the word green banned? 
Usually if something like that's happening, someone's getting bullied and they're not taking it well. People have been enjoying music for thousands of years. That's true. Capemen would just listen to sticks and rocks. Back in my day. You're going to crash the game? Please don't crash my game. <laughs> please, please don't go out of the way to crash my game. Ban the word free speech. First of all, that's two words. Second of all, why? Oh, good. We're on ice. Good. Good. I'm not going to read that one. What happens if you continue the game after it crashes? If you hit continue after it crashes, it brings me back to the truck. But I don't like doing that because this changes... Why didn't I try to catch that? This changes the seed for Feebass every time. If I just start a new game. What I usually do is after stream, I just set up a new run. I save it and I close it so it's ready for later, for the next Friday. I don't have to worry about it when I get set up. What's with all the Tropiuses? It's a lot of Tropiuses. All right, let's sack Mewtwo for funsies. Let's try to weaken it with Joe Broski and try to catch it easy. A Pokemon? I will check it out. I hope it is something very valuable and helpful. Because Tropius is going to get clowned on by Combusken. It's fine for the other fights, but it's going to get clowned on by Combusken. Mewtwo Backspite is stanky. I told you, Mewtwo is built like Ice Spice. What is the best Pokemon movie? The first one with Mewtwo. But I also like the one with Celebi a lot and the one with Deoxys a lot too. If the one with Latias is considered a movie, don't like that one. Post-training arc Cyberman. You are the other dinosaur. I'm just going to do Cyberman. First one is excellent. It's very good. The Rise of Dark Rise Lander. Uh, where are these coming from? Why is it so common? What is happening? Why are we getting so... That's four. Why is it so common? Is this another one? Okay. It's called a Tropical Lemonade. I remember when it was released in cinema. I remember that. I remember that shit. And my controls are inverted. Let's see what you guys sent. Kyogre's movie a lot? I didn't know there was a Kyogre one. I just remember seeing it in the anime. Groudon! We take those. It won't obey, but we take those. Uh, you can replace, unfortunately, we're gonna have to get rid of you 2 and Latias here. Wismer! It's shiny, but all of me wants to release this. All of me? Every bone in my body wants me to get rid of this after too many types. It wants me to throw this to the Shadow Realm. It wants me to yuck this Wismer. But it is shiny. So I can't. Oh, we got an Ampharos. Wait, 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 wait. This is useful. This is useful. This is useful. It's slow, but it's useful. Okay, here's what we're going to do. The only thing is the Ampharos doesn't obey us and the Groudon doesn't obey us. And the Drought helps Combuskin. Could anything else serve here? You know what? It's worth It's worth just trying to beat May with this team. It's worth it. We'll just, we'll just teleport. Just teleport and get it back. It does? It sweeps? That's insane if it sweeps. That is crazy if it sweeps. How are we going to beat Combuskin? Don't you have badges? Oh, wait. Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Someone gave me... Watson's badge. Is it Watson? No, Flannery's badge. 
I think some stuff does obey us. I don't know what that level cap is off the top of my head, but there's a good chance they obey us. Thank you, whoever did that. What is your question, Blue Kirby? What is your answer, Bagel? More Manaphy's movie? That makes sense. Manaphy has a movie, but I didn't know that either. Also, why did it have to hit me? Why did... You know what? We're going to teleport. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. We're going to put Cradily in the front until we get to May. I just want to get to the goddamn river. How was your day? You know how my day was if you watched the beginning of the stream. You know the answer to that. I explained my whole day. I fell down a lot today. You like Gooby's movie? Gooby's movie is a top three for sure. Top three co co contender for sure. Uh, it's tough because does it beat... Does it beat Dark Rise movie as chat likes a lot? Does it beat Deoxys' movie? Maybe. Very well could. I don't know if it beats Mewtwo's movie. Don't think it does, but I think it could beat Celebi's. Okay. Dark Rise Legs. Okay, that, that's a really good point, actually. That was a really strong point as to why that movie's good. This has become the longest run we've ever done. Now that we're at 60 hours, it is officially the longest run on the channel. Officially. Okay, Thundershock. I think it does obey us. Good. We actually, we just got the final badge. Everything obeys. Everything obeys. All Pokemon are good to go. They all obey. <laughs> You'd gladly be thrown. <laughs> What happened to Blue Kirby? <laughs> no, I already slammed it against the wall. I'm a bit worried my neighbors are like, what the fuck was that? Was that Blue Kirby getting thrown against the wall? Gooby still sweeps. Gooby, I can't, I can't say anything about that. I can't talk to that in any way, shape, or form. I'm not allowed to. I'm not allowed to talk about that. Ampharos was almost about to sweep. Okay, Horde, you're up. You outspeed. Have a ground-type attack. Mudshot will work. They're going to call the cops this time. I did get a noise complaint letter, but it was to everyone, so I don't know if it was because of me. I have no idea. Say thank you? Hey, uh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Probably was. I wouldn't doubt it. I wouldn't doubt it. I'm definitely the loudest one in the evening in this building. Unless someone's, like, coming back drunk from the bars that are right next to me at, like, 1 in the morning and being extra loud. Mean is doing well and didn't get old yellered. Look, Mean is just hanging out in its little daycare box. It's happy, it's healthy, it's safe. You <laughs> need to be two doors down at least. Nobody's like directly next to me, but I'm not sure if there's a room behind this wall or not. I'm not positive. They're across the hall, but I don't know if those uh that wall is like the in-between. I have no idea. We can go fishing as long as there's no reset we can go fishing you'd be knocking when i'm streaming when i used to do ngp radio newgrounds radio you know what we'll put in the ladios just because uh i mean deserves some time out of the box uh when i did like newgrounds radio newgrounds podcast we don't have why don't we have we have the badge we don't have surf. We're soft blocked. You know, it doesn't mean we can't try fishing. There's water we can fish on. <sighs> okay. Uh, people would come to my apartment and knock on my door while I was uh, alive. Is what I was going to say. 
Are you trying to crash the game? Are you attempting to crash the game on purpose? Are you going out of your way to crash the game? With your stupid unknown? Your stupid unknown? Did I get the balls? I did. I'm good. I'd slap the shit out of my roof with my broom. If I heard, okay, Chad, send piggies in your Discord. I never said that bar for bar, okay? I I I I I misspoke. I never wanted your piggies. Never wanted that. Don't want that. Continue to not want that. I'm not him. I will continue to not be him. <laughs> okay, we're registered. I want to make sure if we have surf or not. We do, thank God. Okay. Yeah, starfish inspection time is one I said bar for bar, but it wasn't real. Okay. I hope to God we find this feebass fast. And we start using that fucking controller. Don't... <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to open Discord after stream and it's going to be a bunch of pictures of literal pigs. It could be. There is a seed. I know there's a seed that lands on either of these two tiles I'm facing, for sure. It could be any of the three actually. It could be any of the tiles in the river. It's not this one. I don't think it's this one. I don't think you can lower it level than 2. Maybe 1. I don't know, but it d it definitely doesn't go to 0. We are actually fishing for once. We just gotta find the tile now. We just need this stupid fucking tile. The initial hard part of this shiny catching. We could RNG it too. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't want to RNG it. I'm just mentioning we could. Just save and reset. Save and reset. RNG, manipulate that shit. An hour and a half to start fishing. To try any tile. To get the tile one of the day. So using the rod, I need to find the tile. That's what we decided at the start of stream. That we'd wait until we start getting fee basses. Once we get fee basses, the controller comes out. A sad tale how you are just am now wait, you just now am able to play Pokemon? Spit Cole, what happened? Why only just now? What is your sad tale? You said your piggy. It better be a pig. Better not be a toe. I don't want any toes in the Discord. If there's any toes in the Discord, you will get removed from the Discord. It won't work, Mick. It won't work. It's been attempted. My guts. No, no, okay. No, no. You, don't, you don't have to go because somebody s said feet. The amount of times I've, I've done this today, it's been a lot. It's been a lot of times. Why is there a jellyfish in the river? It's a freshwater jellyfish. It's freshwater. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on, there's a sad tale. There's a sad tale. So me and my parents are Christians. So I was wanting to play Pokemon. Because the creator is a Satanist. They said no. They said, let me look and see if there's anything bad in it. Now I'm here. Wait. Don't let your parents see me. I'm not a Satanist. Don't let them see me. They will never let you play Pokemon. Don't, I'm wearing a shirt that says, says, don't bully me, I'll come. Do not, do not let your parents see me. That would be a huge issue for you. <laughs> It'd be a major issue. 
That is a sad story, but I'm glad you're able to play now. <laughs> All good, Cole. I hope you enjoy gaming. All of tonight's boy. <laughs> Dude, I got... I got so sweaty today from skiing. My whole body was soaked. I was wearing a shirt just like this, except it didn't have the text. It was just all white. It was transparent by the end of the day. My underwear was soaked, but it was all sweat. That is an extreme level. That is an extreme level, Deca Chad. All right, what's up, my spoinks? I know, I know a person in real life who set up an OnlyFans for pay piggies. And they showed, they didn't show me the OnlyFans because they don't want me to see that, but they showed me like the DMs they get and stuff. And it's insane. It blew my mind. It's at the lowest level right now. It doesn't go lower than two, Aqua. So, okay, somebody's piggies. Do I have to ban someone? Thank God it's pigs. It's pigs! It's pigs! We're safe. It's actual pigs. We're good. I respect that too, uh, Alexander AM buddy. I respect it too. But that is cr Seeing that shit is crazy. That shit is crazy. Because it is wild dudes. It is wild dudes who pop up in those DMs. Very, very wild dudes. I don't know how to give you a 100 point refund. I would, Aqua, but I actually don't know how. I genuinely don't know how to do that. And I apologize. I did warn, though. I did say it's impossible. Is this real? Is this real? Is this real? Finally! Finally, it's time! Oh, let's set the controller up. Let's get it all schematic and and, and and configured. This is up. This is down. This is left. This is right. What oh shit? What did I set to start? S start is this. You select B A. L and R don't matter. L and R don't matter. And let's tick up that Feebas counter one. It's happening. Don't check the. What did you do? I don't. This is not the fish I need. This is not the fish I need. <laughs> That's 200 Feebas. Please tell me this is real. Come on, baby. 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 I need to make sure this is real before I do anything else. You might have said that you people are evil. You people are evil. You are evil people. Evil people. Pretty sure it was real. We have to double check and make sure. It was level 20, which feels low to me. I'm, I'm worried about that. It would be crazy timing if it wasn't though. It was real. It was a real Feebas. Finally. Finally, Chad. Finally. More Wigglytuff is good. <laughs> okay, you know what we're gonna do? What we're gonna do for the, the start of this? We're not gonna use the select button. That is what we're gonna do. We're gonna cast. And this is how we're gonna catch him. <sighs> okay. Good. Not great, but good. 
This has got to be the run. Please. 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 That was the hunt. We finally found our first fee bass. It is sick. This run is sick. The run could begin finally at 10 o'clock at night. He starts the run. My arms feel shit. Very strong from all the skiing, all the pole using today. It's just a card. It's just a card. Yeah, it's been six resets, Earth Serpent. It's been six. Six fucking chat resets. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. I feel so much better doing this today. Using this controller because I haven't been using it the entire time. It's so it's so hard to do it when you're doing this. Super fun! Can't wait for this month's procrastination. I'm excited to see it. I slept more than usual last night, to be honest with you. Even though I was on the couch and I had to get up early, and I woke up a lot. Oh shit! Come on, baby. Shit! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Am I gonna have to check the PC? Has anything popped up? Because I will set a number of feebass I will encounter before that. Of, of course, of course, Brandy Bleasus. Of course. Tell you what, I'll check at 2175. Two feeds? That is pure evil of you. <laughs> After an hour. I, you know what? No, I'm not going to lose my mind. I'm not going to lose my mind. I'm not going to lose my mind. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to do this right. We're going to fish, and we're going to be fishermen, and we're going to do it right. We're going to have it, a delicious passion fruit seltzer. Come on, baby. We hit 80 hours? What do you mean we hit 80 hours? Fishing music and hat. I'm going to keep the hat off because it blocks my eyeballs. But I will put on the fishing music. Okay. It does. It feels so much better. This run is so much easier to do when the fishing music is on. It is so much less tense. I feel so much less angry. I'm just... Whew. Just... See, look, watch this. It's a jellyfish. It's fine. Sometimes you reel in a jellyfish. Sometimes you reel in a crab. Sometimes you reel in a boot. And it's fine. Just a happy little mistake. Sometimes your cast isn't perfect. <laughs> Sometimes you get EOS. And it, it's just a happy little mistake. No big deal. Uh, I think my cord is starting to actually break. Nobody tell him it's too light. Whew, come on. There we go. There we go. Sometimes the fish gets away. It's just a little happy little mistake. Sometimes, sometimes you reel in too soon. It's all is chill. All is good. We need that magic card frame, and we need to get the 50-50. What port does your camera use? A USB port. USB A.
Sometimes the fish gets away. Hooray. I think I've actually lost my mind today. This is from We Play. It is from We Play. It is the fishing music from We Play. Sometimes you get distracted. Don't let yourself get distracted. It's not a happy mistake. That's just a mistake. And don't do it again. <sighs> Fuck it. Good. Did you get a P.O. box? This was sent to FedEx. But I should just get a P.O. box. We play with this would be sick. We play with this controller would be so sick. If it had like the motion controls from the Wii. Is it because of the tank mode? I actually fucked with a lot of Wii Play games. I didn't love the dancing one where you had to pose in the bubbles. I did love air hockey. That was dope. I didn't mind like the one where you ride the cow. I love the tank game. I like the fishing game. I like the shooting game. There's a lot to like about Wii Play. Tank game is the best one though. What I need to do is I need to purchase this uh, external power USA hub that uh, Alarok linked me. I need that because I think it's the power from everything eating. Like it's just fucking with things and the camera is probably the heaviest one. Pool wasn't bad on Wii Play either. Wii Play was just goaded. All those Wii games are sick. Even Wii Music I liked a lot. I played the shit out of Wii Music. They're just fantastic games. And they're all goofy. You best switch up that attitude. <laughs> Alcoholism? I don't think that's up. in a few times the music is all right i liked it i liked it i enjoyed it there's a nice intro to wanting to write music <laughs> look i'm doing a fisherman does not always fish perfect fisherman must be patient it's all about patience before you get the big one did captain ahab catch moby dick in a day no that's absurd it's just absurd Go get a drink. I have a drink. I've been drinking a drink. I'll get another one. Look, this. What the odds be that I look away and I look back and there's the shiny fee bass and it's already dead? What the odds of that be? Wii music gets too much shit. Yeah, people don't like that game, and I love it. I like it a lot. The novel Moby Dick, greatest contribution to the world is Starbucks. <laughs> it's Starbucks and penis jokes. Those are its only two real contributions to the modern world today. Don't compare yourself to him. I am hunting for the Moby Dick of Pokemon. Let's be honest. You drunk a drunk. Drinking a drink? Not really. I mean, drink is like a, 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 a... It's one of those things where it's like a word just people use for an alcoholic drink. It's like a nickname of sorts. It would be like, I'm drinking an alcoholic drink. <laughs> I'm surprised this one does not get copyright claimed. Probably because it sounds nothing like the original song, composition-wise, like, at all. It's so, like, very much different. Ah! I wasn't ready for that one. I, I didn't think it was going to come up that fast. You just got all blip? 
What do you mean? Why is my cradley asleep? <laughs> it's way harder to time this than the controller. It's so I forgot how hard it is. We're pulling up bass. We're doing it. We're pulling them in. We just need the right one. We just need the right one. Oh, it's probably because compositionally they're not that different. It's just instrumentally they're different. Like if you listen to this one, there's all kinds of stuff happening other than the melody. The other ones are like one-to-one -one midis with different instruments. This is like an actual remix. When's the Wii Sports Resort Island Flyover All Info Points streams? I don't know. I've never played that one. I never got to play Wii Sports Resort. And I'm kind of sad about it. I'm kind of fucking sad about it. My friend had it. And I didn't even get to play it at his house. My parents never bought it for me. Fucking... I caught Moby in a single 9 to 5. That's a skill issue. Didn't you RNG manipulate it? Didn't you use RNG to do it? Because that could take minutes. That could take minutes. Why did Vanilla Ice get copyrighted? Oh, we got a lizard. I'm gonna let this one back in the water. Swim away! I hear Wii Sports Resort is very good. I also think that the... It is not US. It is not US. I can see. I can see myself. <laughs> um... I also think the speedruns in Wii Sports Resort are funny. They have some good speedruns in Wii Sports Resort. Don't chant US. I just froze. I think it's because my camera is trying to stop itself because it's like, ah, ah, I'm freaking out. But I've set it to not do that, so the EOS now only happens like at times where it has a power problem. You're scaring me. You're scaring me. I have to keep, I'm like, I can barely see my head over my browser that's open in front of OBS, so I'm like, no, that's my eyes. No EOS here. You can't see what I'm seeing, but it's like, Hang on. I'll show you what I mean. This is my vision of me right now. This is my vision. So I'm like, did someone say US? No. Wait, no. <laughs> it's not, it's not, it's not. <laughs> let, me, let me fix this. You can't fool me. Most of the time. <laughs> it's not in the US. It's not in the US! <laughs> Imagine somebody new comes in. <laughs> Somebody new comes into the stream and everyone is just writing EOS and I'm going, No, stop! Stop! What are they thinking? What are they thinking? What are their thoughts? Oh, is it running at a, uh, a, a relatively high power? At the same time, I just have too much stuff plugged into this computer. Like, I'm running a drawing tablet, you know what I mean? That's not a monitor that I'm looking at when I look this way. It's a full drawing tablet. Which takes a ton of power to run. And it's not off external, it's just from the computer. I mean, th that's an external device, but you know what I mean. Ugh! Throw- Ugh! They would chant EOS along. They would- they would become one with chat immediately. Your computer's not even on. You're just sitting in a dark room. <laughs> talking to yourself. 
My mic isn't working. It's working. I can hear myself. I can hear myself when it goes through OBS. You can't fool me with that one. I would know right away. I would immediately know as soon as I try to say something. That would be a funny... I kind of want to animate that. Me just sitting in a dark room. Like, it's a, it's a clip from stream where I'm, like, talking to chat, but it's just me in a dark room and there's no computer or anything. It's, like, me facing the corner of the room. Did that tick up? Your ears aren't working. How does that make sense? You hear too much. You're hearing too many things. Thus, your ears aren't working. The schizo Chris animation. <laughs> the one where I go... <laughs> Is that a Feebass I see, chat? Is that a Feebass I see? I'm playing with little action figures. I'm playing with little toys and dolls. And nobody's in the room. My chat is that a Phoebus? I am the Captain Ahab. And I'm catching Moby Dick. All good, Blue Kirby. Don't worry about it. All good. Try to enjoy. GTA 5 edits where they take scenes at, but mod out all the people so it's like a guy <laughs> in a schizophrenia episode. <laughs> exactly like that. There's nothing even on the screen. There's no screen. It's just me in a room. It's me in an all-white room, but the lights are off. There's like one light in the room, and it's shining on my face menacingly. Why? Why? Oh, my controls are inverted. What? That was your clip you sent to the clips channel? I would love if this was it. It's not, but I would love it. I know your name. Is this Feebass in the room with us right now? Show us on the doll where the Feebass touched you. It sucked on my nip. I picked the purple Feebass up and put it right here and it went... <laughs> like a small baby to their mother. Belk. Don't check the keep PC, keep fishing. Like I said, 2175, I have full faith that we'll be fine. If faith will be fine. 75 is what I said. I remember because Brandy wrote, mm K, 2175. What? What? <laughs> okay. Here we go. That, that one wasn't even me. We just didn't get a bite. Sometimes the fish don't bite. It's fine. It happens. Okay. I need this in the next three. I need a shiny Feebass in the next three. And if I get a shiny Magikarp or Tentacle, that might be the end of stream forever in the next three. Miguel. <laughs> Yo, Miguel, what's up? <laughs> Miguel, welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> That's wild. That's a very Florida thing to do. Call someone Miguel. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Your right earbud is dead. I hope I sound good in your left ear. That used to piss me off when one earbud dies. Even before AirPods and that shit. How many other shiny Pokemon have you seen? I've seen two real ones so far. Two real ones. A Tentacool and then the Zigzagoon at the very beginning of the game. And they're both gone forever. It was Zigzagoon and Tentacle. Enjoy your time, Blue Kirby. I mean, Bilk. Okay, that was a good cast. That was a better cast. Good. Good. 
good, good. Shit! Okay, there better not be a purple one in the PC. I liked, I liked you thinking, Kai. I think it's 76, but we have to check the PC first. Do I have the running shoes? I don't. This do be Gen 7. This is true. Thing is, I've never played Gen 7, but I know a lot of the music. It's the only Gen I haven't played, but I... Uh, can I get back to the Pokemon Center? No, I can't. I just have to wait this out. Okay, I'm good. It was a short one. God, it hurts to use the buttons on this children's fishing rod controller. Let's heal Cradilly, and I have full faith we don't have a purple Feebas in the PC. I know I do, Peter. I know I do. If we get to 10 resets in one night, I might go actually crazy. Okay. That's not good. Um. Um. Why are you adding more? We're good. We're good. We're still going. We're still going. We're still going. We're still in this. Where was the tile? Where was the tile? Okay, I think we were... We're at the bottom by the rock. Oh shit, we're stuck. I think we were at the bottom by the rock in the middle, facing up. It's like near the beginning. Is your shiny? Look, I am fully focused. I'm fully focused right now to get this Feebas. I think you're right. I th I'm pretty sure it's right here. I'm pretty sure it's right here, right? Is it not right here? I can make sure. I have the stream up in front of me. It is right here. It's right here. Okay, good, 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 good. Good. We're still in this. I'm gonna turn off the cast because I'm starting to get my arm a little sore. We'll come back to it. Yeah, it's right here. Fishing music, we already went through the whole playlist. We have a very short fishing playlist. Shiny Feebas imminent? I hope you don't mean in the PC. <laughs> Not the cast. I've been skiing all day. I've been doing this all day. Trying to pick myself up. After 11 falls on the mountain. <laughs> From the lake. We love to see it. It's got to be today. 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 It did do well. That's true. People seem to really think that was cool. It's not. I could. It's not a US. It's not that you scared me, but it's not. Who <laughs> up casting they rod? Who else feeding their bass? Who else playing with their rod and feeding their bass? Play Freebird? This channel would get shut down. <laughs> it looks like an EOS. You kind of look like an EOS, Chris. I liked it better when it was EOS. Can you turn off your mic, too? I'd like that a lot more. This is still the same run. We're still in it. This is the same one as when we found our first bass of the day. We're still going. We're climbing up to 2200. And I'll tell you what. 
I'm not afraid to hit it. Because I think at the end of this stream, we're ending up with a purple bass. Whether chat likes it or not, it's getting on this rod. The Von Karma short. Check PC at 2222. Deal. Bet. <laughs> My favorite short on this channel could be the one about Mozart. I really think that one's funny. <laughs> it might be the funniest joke ever. Maybe. Someone could use that as an 808. <laughs> that could be a that could be a base for a beat. That boom boom. It's great. It's a good bit. It's a good bit. It's a good bit. It's a great bit. It's an excellent bit. Come on, with those edits to Mozart's face. Come on. The Mosus. Come on. Come on. That's fire. That's fucking heat. I'm not gonna lie. You're not gonna tell him? <laughs> Don't tell him. Don't tell them. The entire joke was awful, then the jig. Look, he would obviously do the jig to that music. That's the thing. He would obviously do the jig. I think the idea of Mozart looking all sneaky and being like, I'm going to play with my dick. I'm going to oh, 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 I'm going to play with my dick. Oh, 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 I'm going to play with my dick. I think that's hilarious to that music. As a man of my word, I shall ask, will we get some Jirashi run attempts? I think we could do that tonight. I think we could do that. I have to figure out an optimal way to use the controller a little better than the last time. But I think we could do it. Walking into someone doing that. Imagine walking into Mozart doing that. You're like, oh, Mozart! What piece, what extravagant, wonderful piece could you be working on this fine afternoon? Mozart! Wolfgang Amadeus! And you open the door. You, are, you open the door, and it's just fucking... <laughs> I'm gonna play with my dick! I'm gonna play with my dick! <laughs> That's the funniest... Well, not for that person. That's funny as hell. I like how it went back to the same track. That was kind of nice. It was on shuffle. It was kind of... That's what I'm saying. That's what I added at the end of the short. He ate poop. He's a weirdo. It's not out of character. Two soft buttons above the D-pad. That's what I was originally thinking, too. I want to incorporate this somehow. But I don't know exactly how yet. Look, it came up, and I needed to explain it because I'm right. Asgore and Mario music, perhaps. Perhaps, perhaps. It's in the next video. I'm still waiting to release. Hopefully the next video. We might have another one ready before this one's released from its prison. Why aren't you? For reeling in the opposite direction, that'd be fun. That would be nice. I would like to be able to like just do one of these. Make things go really fast. Peanut Gallery, welcome! Welcome to today's stream. We've had six resets before we ever got a fee bass, and now we have a good run going, finally. Hi, Nut. That's a hard name. One controls each paddle. That would be actually kind of wild. You are the pinball machine. You become the pinball machine. 
Two was a freeze. Two were freezes. This is true, but it still counts. It's always counted. Fuck. Fuck. It's the year of the high nutter. <laughs> the high nutters. Dudes who get high and nut. Do you know what I learned about skiing today? Speaking of uh, the feeling of nutting. I learned that the best part of skiing is not skiing well. It's not the adrenaline you get going fast. It's not a job well done. It's not feeling like you did something good and you were healthy and you burned a lot of calories. No, the best feeling about skiing is getting your damn boots off and fucking taking a shower. That is the best feeling I've ever felt. This is from Sonic. So kind of, Nick. Sort of. Getting your boots off after wearing skiing or snowboarding boots is incredible. It's not at a higher level. Fucking pull it in. Pull it in. Pull it in, Chris. Come on. Come on. Come on. What is happening? Okay, 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 okay. There we go. This better be it. This better be it. It's not even a fee bass. Listen to your coworkers go to the bathroom. That's the worst part. That was the worst part of the whole time. Three shiny feet just slipped off the rod. It could have been. It could have been. It very well could have been. Very well could have been. That's the sad part. Then again, it's just a frame and it has nothing to do with the fee bass. Even if we get the frame, it's still 50-50. Because it's built off of Magikarp and Tentacles frames right now. Snorting, she was laughing so hard at that story. At the skiing story? I thought that was another good one. I think, um, my previous New York story, my second one, wasn't all that good. It wasn't the best one, so I never made a video out of it. It was alright, had moments. I think that one's pretty good. I might make a video with that one. So usually when I'm with those co-workers, wild shit happens because we're all just wild together. We do dumb things. Should have worn all those layers. I did wear way too much. I'm not going to lie to you. I did wear way too much. I was soaked. I was drenched. I smelled awful. I smelled like motor oil today. It was brought up to me in the car. My coworker turned to me. I'm in the front seat. And she's like, what is that smell? And I take off my sweater. And she's like, it's your sweater? I'm like, it's a hot sweater. It's made of wool. It was like 40 out there. It wasn't that cold. Oh. You sweat motor oil. It's it, it the, the sweater itself has kind of a weird smell to it that I haven't been able to get out that's similar to motor oil, and I think my sweat just made that kind of pungent. That's a gross word to use, Chris. Bracing. Oh, my camera went out. Back. You get it? I'm a kind of a wuss to it, too, and I live in the cold. I breathe the cold. I was born in the cold. I was made by the cold, and I hate it. I, 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 I'm a weenie about it. Only when he's in New York. New York, it's never cold. It's always 100 degrees with 100% humidity. Never a dry heat in New York. Our pits are filled with Nickelodeon slime from all the sweat, but that's just New York. You're immune to cold from plowing? That will do it. Plowing is a really hard job. But I have a theory about plowing as well. And maybe this includes you, Kai, but maybe it doesn't. 
I have a theory that there's a gang of people who plow, right? Every person who plows is part of the group of people who plow. They all text each other. They have a group chat going. Whenever there's a snowstorm, they get stoked. They kiss their wives on the cheek and they go, Honey, I have to do my duty. And they all excitedly text each other in their group chat and they go, It's time to plow, boys. Get your beers ready. And they get hammered when they do it as they're slamming against the walls of their plow truck. At two in the morning. Fucking hammered. The plow boys. Didn't get to experience cold weather much until moving to Kansas. Oh, minus 20 is nuts. We've had that. We've had that here. Just parking lots. That's a better way to do it. Plowing the highways sucks. I've never done it, but it sucks. One time my grandfather stopped by and he plows. Or he did. He doesn't plow anymore. He's a lot older. But I was in college and my grandfather stops by my parents' house as I'm living there. He's like, hey, boy. I'm like, uh, hello, grandfather. He's like, come on, boy. Get in the truck. Come on. We're going to go plow for Christ's sake. Let's go plow, boy. Come on. I'm like, okay. And I get in. And it's like a nightmare. It's literally like you slam against everything, and it's very rough. But not only that, he hands me a child sippy cup. He goes, boy, oh, boy, drink this. Drink this sippy cup, boy. I go, what? Why do you have a little baby sippy cup? He goes, big boy, drink this sippy cup. Come on. Christ's sakes, boy. What the hell ails you? I go, okay, grandfather. And I take a sip of the sippy cup, and it's straight gin. He does not plow anymore, though. That is a shame, Peanut Gallery. Much love to you as well, then. But not in a weird, uh, 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 parasocial way. Parasocial type beat way. Michigan is weird. Last year in March, it got to 70, almost 80 degrees. Next week, it was almost slow blizzard. New England's the same way. New England's very similar. Gin is how you stay warm. That's how you keep your belly warm. My grandfather's a legend. He's a legend. He's an absolute legend. He's done a lot of shit in his life. I learned right before I went skiing that the man was a trick skier. He used to do like water skiing and do like front flips and stuff. Someone say parasocial? <laughs> Here I am. I've arrived. It's me. Mr. Pache, I don't like the cold unless it snows. I just think the snowy atmosphere is nice, but lately here in Mass, we're just getting a lot of rain. That's what New England's been like. It's been a couple small snowstorms and tons of rain. Tons of it. Tons of it. If you're talking about Massachusetts when you say MA. But it's exactly the same here. I'm, I'm right next to Massachusetts. It's ex exactly the same. Right there. But I agree with you. I like snow one day of the year. I like it when it's pretty and it first falls and nobody's touched it yet. That's the best snow. That's the only good snow. Then after that, it becomes all muddy and icky and plowed and disgusting and it's freezing cold and I don't care about it. I don't care to shovel it. Kai, thank you for the membership. Jury Ann got it. Let's go. Thank you for the membership. Shout out Jury Ann. We can all hope to be a cool grandpa someday. I want to be an awful grandpa. I want to be that grandpa that, like, can't hear shit, but, like, fake it. I want people to think I'm the grandpa that can't hear shit and can't see shit and is, like, kind of out there, but I'm completely fine. You in Rhode Island or something? Or Connecticut? You don't have to answer that. Don't dox yourself. Snow in winter just becomes a burden and in the way. I graduated, so no snow days anymore. You got the hell out of there. Exactly. The slush and gray mush and the poopy yellow and brown snow? Gross. Don't care for it. Don't care much for it. Has no use for me. Like, when it's like midnight, nobody's done shit about the snow and everything looks pretty and pristine and calm and quiet, that's good. As soon as that ends, it's over. 
I will never be a grandpa. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. A great grandpa someday. You mean like like literally like a grandpa who has a son that's also a grandpa? Or like a good ass grandpa, cool ass grandpa. Driving in the snow. I never was the type to do donuts in the snow because it made me nervous. Made me get nervous with my shitty cars. I've never had a car that I owned that was mine that uh, was good in the snow. Fuck. Fuck, dude. There we go. You don't plan on driving in the snow? You shouldn't want to. You shouldn't want to. The only reason to drive in the snow to enjoy it is to do like donuts and shit. I've been like, I've been like with uh, uh, friends and they'll do the donuts and stuff and that's a lot of fun. I don't trust myself with that. I feel like I'd be bad at that. I'd crash into something, that'd be my luck. Like if I have the kind of luck where I'm just walking home from a sandwich place down the street from me and it's, it's, it's like a 20 feet walk. A little longer than that, but you get the idea. And a homeless man will jump out, take half of my sandwich, eat it like a corn cob, and run off. I should not do donuts in the snow. And I think that's a simple math equation. And it's just two plus two is four. That happens, and don't do donuts. Don't enjoy taking risks? I don't blame you. We're playing Jackbox? I already said we would do the Jirachi uh, uh, percent with the fishing rod on Pokemon Pinball. I might need to warm up without the fishing rod real quick, just so I can be like, ah, oh, now I remember how to play it. But we'll do it with the fishing rod if we do it. Like, I won't do a full run of warm up. I just do like a few lives. Fuck. He earned that sandwich? He, he must have stalked that sandwich place and waited for some idiot like me, some sucker like me to appear. So all he did was go, Ah! I'm homeless! Give me your sandwich! And I, it was enough to make me go, Okay! <laughs> I am the type of person that goes to the grocery store and they say, Do you have a rewards card? And I say, No, no, but I'd love one. They're like, you would? And I'm like, no. They're like, okay, then don't get one. And I'm like, no, I'll, I'll get it. I, pr I should probably have it. I'm also the kind of guy that goes to the stir-fry station at the grocery store with my coworker, and my coworker gets the stir-fry and I want something else at the same station. But they're so deep into the stir-fry, I'm like, well, now I don't want to be a bother. I can't ask for this. Th I'll just go get like a frozen chicken. I'll get a frozen chicken and put it in the microwave. That's what I'll do. I don't, I don't want to be a bother. They're busy. Why the donut? Why, why did the donut appear? That awful, awful donut. That's perfect, Cloth. Let's go. Fuck. Kind of blind at night. I feel like I'm getting worse at driving at night, too, but I think also my windshield wipers are just messed up, and it messes up my windshield a lot. What is a stir-fry station? It is a station where you go and you say, I would like to get the stir-fry, and they say, okay, pick out the ingredients like a Subway, and they make you stir-fry. If there's any New Englanders in the chat, uh, we could we let's let's you and I chat for a second. Shaz, let's go. Market basket, let's go. Hannaford's, uh, Hannaford stir fry station, let's go. Thank you. His own piece, like a gun. Beef up his personality? No. No, I'm just nice. I'm just nice. I need people to uh, think I'm nice and cool at all times. I've done mean things before, though, too. We've talked about this. Spark plugs, if anyone remembers that. Just not talking. All good, Mercury. I support lurkers. 
YouTube is one of the greatest places to lurk. If you're on Twitch, it's not really meant for lurking. YouTube, that's fine. Kick, leave. <laughs> Sits in the window for a day, at the end of the day you get a big discount. So like, if it's old food, they're just like, yeah, you, whatever, we need to get rid of it. I remember the spark plug. I'm not retelling that one, but it's funny. I told my parents about the spark plug spark plugs bit that I did the other night, and they frowned. They didn't think it was as funny. The whole kick is gonna take over streaming thing died. Yeah, no. No, they're not gonna take over. It was just like a big thing because they were spending so much money on streamers. I wanna do spark plugs to be cool with Chris. Go to your local Walmart and you can. You can. It's not hard. Just go into your healthy stomach aisle. <laughs> Skeptical, hello. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to, today. welcome to tonight's stream. That's what I meant to say. Advertise gambling? Absolutely. Absolutely was. Because it's owned by a gambling thing. By casinos. Absolutely. You know what's crazy is how big gambling is right now. Like, sports betting has been approved in, like, most states in the United States over the last year. We're doing it at 22222. Though that is kind of you to say 2250. And what's crazier is these apps have come out, like like DraftKings, for example, where it's turned into social media to gamble. Which is insane. Like, you'll get notifications like, Hey, your best friend just made a terrible bet on this. Why don't you make the same one? And then you get a notification about it again an hour later. Just crazy they can do that. Really gone big for str big streamers. It is kind of smart. They have the money to spend. Like, you can't really blame streamers too much for doing that. It is a really bad look. But you can't really blame them for that much money. It's a lot of money. Because whether or not, like... Whether or not you're going to be doing shit that they want you to do, like gambling on stream and whatever, and doing things you can't do on Twitch and YouTube, that's just the money you could use not only for your personal benefit, but also for your stream's benefit. Imagine the cool-ass shit you could do with that much money. $200 million for XQC. Imagine the streams you could make with $200 million. Imagine! And what's crazy to me is we're not getting that. <laughs> You don't get that from XQC. He just pocketed it and put it on his watch. That's insane. $200 million! You could make the craziest show of your life. You could do that! Without making a real huge dent in the money. You could make movies for that much money. Will you ever get a shiny fee best today? Watch this. That one doesn't count. The controllers I can build with that kind of money. Too much to bring it, do anything is morally bankrupt. It is pretty morally bankrupt. It is pretty morally bankrupt. Which is a funny way to put it too. When you talk about money. But let's say you can multi-stream, right? Let's say you are XQC who streams on Twitch and Kick. Just try to promote people to go to Twitch more. And use the money to make the coolest thing ever. I don't know. It's a, it's a weird situation. I think what I'm mad at about that whole situation in general is just pocketing the money. Just using it to flex the money. Yeah, of course you're going to help your family first. But like, a, a, a $4 million house is insane. That's an insane house. A $10 million house is an insane house. You have 20 more of those in your pocket. It's like an unbelievable, unimaginable house. 
You could build a little town for your family. Just Shadow, welcome. Like a general? Hang on. You give some of it to me? You shouldn't do that, but I appreciate it. I guess only if you want to. Chin's Fishe. He streams every Friday. Yeah, if you can do it for positive things, sure. I mean, he shit on the platform anyways. He was like watching movies on the platform and getting streams taken down for that because, the, the, you know, you can't stream a movie. 4 a.m. Go to sleep. It is 11 here. If you're going to shit on the platform that gave you $200 million anyways, do this. Do something good and tell your viewers, don't come to kick. Don't do it. Don't become Jeff Bezos. You become like an eccentric millionaire. <laughs> I would become a villain. I'd become evil with that kind of money. You take your dog on a walk? I will do my best to catch it. Too bad I am Jeff Bezos. And I am so bald. I get my head waxed every day because I have money. Can everyone do me a favor that's in chat right now that's also in the Discord? Can you all uh, ping Bill Primo and say Bill? Just in all caps, Bill. What is the deal with the Rumble YouTube thing? I don't remember. I shared that with Chris. I'm not bald. You put 200 million on GameStop, you would make 400 million. It's like betting on black and winning. Or I guess betting on red in this case. Or both. What did Bill do? Doesn't matter, just do what I say. Why ask questions? Why ask questions when you can do what I say? Do my bidding. Do my bidding. Do not question. Do my bidding. This is about five inches. That's awful big. Really big. What? What is happening? That's massive. Yes, my lord. It's so big. No, in the Discord, in the Discord, in the Discord. We're almost at PC checking time. Thing is, if we get a purple Feebaz, that's probably the end of the run for the night. We'll switch to do something else. I'll set to P. Bill, Bill, Bill! Bill, Bill, Bill! You know what a siren looks like? What does that mean? What do you mean by that? Like a whoop whoop siren? Bill Nye the science guy. Who's gonna be the next Bill Nye? Who's the next one coming up? We need a new Bill Nye. Kids need a new Bill Nye. Who's the next one? Neil deGrasse Tyson ain't doing it. Gazer, thank you for the Gazer luck. I hope it works. I hope it works. I got one more before PC check. One more damn fish. Nile Red? Who is Nile Red? Neil Dadass Tyson. <laughs> Neil Dadass Tyson. I don't have brown hair. I don't have gray eyes. I certainly don't have green skin. <laughs> I am not a siren. Sirens sing, and I never sing on stream. Okay. We have to check the PC. We have to take a check. 
pretty much solid entertainment now. All good, Decka Chad. Please sleep good. Okay. Okay. Comes down to this. Do we have to switch it up and wait another week? I sure hope not. We've gone through these. Oh, it's a shiny mischievous named Banjo. Okay. Comics is free. It's safe. Books is free. Who did this? Who did this? Who did this? Shadow. <laughs> oh, fuck. God, this was a terrible day for Feebas. Welcome back, homemade. Forty eight resets. Forty eight. My fucking word. Let me fix this counter. And let's pause the timer. We're going to switch gears. God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it. Yeah, we're going to do pinball. We're gonna do pinball. Forms? What form do you want to look at? I need a pee though. Wait, what happened? What happened to my camera? Oh. I need a pee though. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put up the BRB screen. I'm gonna pee. And then I will be right back and we'll set up pinball. The background's just started. There's gonna be like two. I'll be right back. I'll be right back.
know what I just noticed? <laughs> just noticed something. Just noticed something. This is a really small shirt, right? It's a nice shirt. It's a small shirt. I noticed this. If I stand up and go back there, right? Purple shirt goes hard. I don't know what you're talking about. like whatever it's like a normal shirt on me right watch what happens when I tuck it in it's like a new human it's like a different human just entered the room it's like old man chins Pache just walked in Sort of. No, you just tucked in your shirt, idiot. <laughs> you don't think I get grandpa energy when I tuck it in? Some guy called Chinzo and Chins is back. You don't think I suddenly have grandpa energy when I do that? Peace again. All good, Blue Curvy, if you're leaving. Virgin, you give? Like, not necessarily even when it's tucked in, you just give virgin energy. My old guitarist had an old man built like that. Oh, bit like that. Sorry, it froze. Grandpa, is that you? That goes hard. Your friend goes hard. Let's change the name of the stream. Nobody's gonna know what that means. Zero people are gonna know what that means. A stamp? When it's tucked in, it doesn't have virgin energy. That's what I'm saying. It suddenly becomes super, like, different. Like, what you, what you have to do is you have to see them side by side. They look like different people. It's the alcohol you've been drinking. <laughs> Just you, you're you're crazy. B Bass has driven you crazy. This is what I'll do. Pop open the Fee Bass. Not the Fee Bass. Pop open the pinball game. I'm gonna mute it too. Because we're gonna play music for this one. Actually, no, we're not. We're gonna do it like normal. We're gonna do it like normal. Oh, this isn't set up. Okay, up, right, down, left. I can't remember what I want if it's A and B. Which one's which? I think it's B, A. Start. Apply. You're gonna call A, A. You don't need to call A, A. I've had two drinks. Three drinks. Fine. I'm gonna play pinball like a god. The ink stamp? You give me a beer with you? I don't think you can drink beer. Okay, let me make sure the controls are how I like. Oh god. What? Why is only the up button giving me any functionality? Ah! What is happening? I, I, I thought it was two, it's three, okay? It's not that many. It's not that crazy. Oh, you had three uh, instead of two. How come it's only letting me go up? Is that normal in Pokemon Pinball? Okay, up, right, left. Left, right, perfect. Beer is terrible. This is a high noon. We do the sapphire table. I gotta remember it. We need to use the tilts. We gotta play with these buttons carefully. It's way harder with this controller though. How many fingers am I holding up? None because you're a chat member. 
Let's give it a shot at least. So we have our two flippers. We tilt, we need up and we need left. So if I'm playing with this, good. You gonna play it with me? Let's go. The goal of this is to try and get Jirachi as fast as possible with a fishing rod. The way it works to get a Jirachi is you want to get nuts. It's referred to as nuts. By the street, the speedrunning community who does this. A triple nut is our goal. It's when it hits the bumper on the right and then the button with the little basket next to it three times in a row because you did it right. Then you get the triple nut and you travel. Six travels brings you to the ruins. The ruins with a bonus gives you Jirachi. I forgot how to do it already. With this controller. Alright. Let's get it back to where... Uh, this is a bad start. What is that? Is that a magic card? The secret to the reverse nut? That is when you reverse your nut. Yes. Yes. True. It was one thing. How was I supposed to see it? Okay, what I did wrong there was I need to hop the ball using the tilt instead of trying to use the bump. The, the flippers. This is so hard with this controller. You were the what? The most what? Gig giggity? What does it mean to be giggity? To be like Quagmire? I don't want to be like Quagmire. Uh, that's not my goal. <laughs> if I woke up one morning and I looked like Quagmire, I might just... I might just jump out the window. Perhaps. This could work. It didn't. Okay, ignore that magic card. We're gonna do it right now. Like, we've never met IRL. <laughs> this has not happened. Okay, here's how you do it for real. Here's how you do it for real. You get it right here. Okay. Nice and soft and safe and sound. You up. Hold this. Up. Uppies. Left. Fuck. That is hard with this controller. Okay, good. No. 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 You <laughs> forgot about me. This bit is insane. Okay. I don't even know if I can do the left thing. I will be the only person in the world to have done this. I, I'm, I'm one of the only people in the world to have used this controller. One of two, I think. <laughs> Technically. Uppies, too short. Too short. This is so hard. This is so hard for this controller. Okay. Uppies. Uppie. Come right back down. Okay. Okay, it's fine. I want to make sure my left and right are working right. I might need to make a separate button for left. You've never played pinball with it? I'm the first person in the world to play pinball with this controller. It went down. Good. Oh, that's what I asked for. Okay, it is working. Alright, let's try it again. You did test it fishing? Good, that was the important thing. You always want to break it before someone else breaks it. A client breaks it. Shit, this is so hard with this controller. Fuck. Pikachu, do something! That was the wrong one. Okay. Land nice and easy. No bad bounces. Thank you. Uppies. 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 Left. Got it. Got it! Got it with the controller! There's a start. Now we need to travel, like LeBron James. Shit. Shit. De the Defiance, hello, welcome. Welcome to Pinball with a Fishing Rod. Okay, good. We don't have a way to use the, uh, the actual reel, though, right now. Which I'm kind of interested in using, even though it would make this way worse. That didn't work. There's zero luck. There's a little bit of luck. There is a little bit of luck. There's a little bit. Fucking fuck it. Come on. Oh, this is 
is hard. This is very hard. Okay. No more deaths. All I want to do is do it. I just want to do it with the fishing rod. Good. Oh, that could have been a triple nut. That could have been the triple nut. And that was a metal pipe. It went down. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for pointing that out. Too short. Okay. Up. Uppies. Good. Good. That'll do it. And travel. Oh. Travel. Come on. You have to get Zigzagoon set up too, by the way. So ideally, we keep that the way it is. It's such a good holiday. I hate Valentine's Day. I'm not a fan. Not a big fan. Come on, come on. Right there. Travel. A. That's one of six. And we got the butthole. Just call me old triple nut. Triple nut gallery. Because <laughs> you're peanut ga gallery. You want to be the triple nut gallery? We need a fresh slate anyways. <laughs> Fuck, this is so hard. This is so hard with this fucking controller. Okay. Okay. Any miscellaneous gift we get through the year? That's kind of a smart way to do it. That's kind of a smart way to do it. Make it less of a big deal. Less of a stressor. More of a dresser. Or an undresser. I like that. I don't like, like... I don't like when stuff feels like... Like, it doesn't feel super genuine to me to do Valentine's, because everyone's doing Valentine's. What the fuck is the point? I just clicked the button. Just click, just... I'm clicking it, and it's, it's just, it's such a weird little analog thing. It's such a weird one. It's hard to get it exact. It's okay, focus. Focus. Don't complain, just focus. Whatever saved. Okay. I love when the Minecraft server works for you and nobody else. I don't know what's up with our Minecraft server. I've heard people saying, like, it keeps going down and stuff. I haven't looked at it since we played on stream the last time, though, which was a long time ago. Ugh, too high. Fuck. Grower and not a shower. Look at a little hot dog. A hot dog fish. Hang on, I want to look at chat, but I have to focus. I have to get this out of here. Valentine's. About how lame Valentine's is, but last year... <laughs> one made a super cute crossword. Here's the thing, you can make like a great Valentine's gift. You can do that any day of the year that has sentimental value to you, though. But it's like, oh, why didn't you give me a Valentine's gift? Everyone else got their Valentine, a Valentine, da, da. It, it's, it's, it's useless. You know what's way more hype than Valentine's Day? You know what's way more hype than Valentine's Day? Groundhog Day? Where we all look at Puxatani Phil and this guy in a top hat goes, he didn't look at his shadow. He looked forward! And we all scream and cheer. That is so much more hype. That is way better. People don't take that serious enough. <laughs> We're celebrating it at work. It's it's the smartest thing ever. It's the coolest shit ever. That we go to a groundhog with a man in a top hat and a suit. Dressed like he's from 1850. And he hoists the groundhog in the air. A groundhog that only lives six years but has the same name as the same groundhog 50 years ago. And we all cheer. That is dope. That is as dope as humanity can get. Shit, it's so... I want to play with the controller so bad. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. D click. <sighs> the same one. It's immortal. How come you're a mod of the Chris Pache stream so you can confirm that Puxatati Phil is immortal? You've never seen a groundhog? I used to have them at my parents' yard all the time when I was a kid. And my mom would get all angry. She'd be like, not a damn groundhog! It's gonna eat my flowers! Good? That'll work. Finally. Finally. Perfect. Perfect. Now we're playing. We're playing with balls, fellas. It's about time. I've been waiting all day to play with these balls. Could have rephrased that a lot better. You coned off its hole, it had a baby. That's kind of cute. It's kind of adorable. Up. Uppies, uppies. Left. And the left didn't go off. They land nice and soft. Okay, don't. Uppies, uppies. Left. Perfect. That'll work. When he grounded on my hog till I pucks it on. Perfect. Let's go. We're still playing with balls. Shit, 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 shit. I don't know how I'm going to force the bonus with this controller. That's going to be way harder. Trying to hit that up button over and over and over again. Let's go, balls! <laughs> Wrong, balls. Okay. Uppies. 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 That could be a triple, and I don't pull it off. I can click the button, right? Oh, please. Good. That's good enough. Uppies. Uppies. That'll work. No! No, and it fucked the zigzagoon! Too high. God, this sucks. This sucks. That'll work. Never mind. It was perfect. Saved. That's not good. Is it meant for bedrock? Our server? Our server is bedrock. Unless you're talking about something else. Perfect. Perfect. If we had a timer, it would be one of the worst runs of all time. <laughs> it would be last on the leaderboard for sure, and by far. By very far. Fuck! Fuck! Up. 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 Good. That'll work. You can join on bedrock. You can. It's only for bedrock because that was what chat wanted back in the day. That will work. 100%. I think the IP is in the Discord and it's pinned in an image. Fuck. That'll do it. Oh, my voice got broken. There we go. We're on pretty solid pace. We are? We Are we actually? Oh, for like last? <laughs> We're playing okay. Good. Good. Triple? No. Up. Uppies. Uppies. Good. We're actually doing it now with the fishing rod. We're actually playing! Shit. No! Yes! Yes! No! <laughs> no! Okay, it'll work. It'll work. BP... What? Refinery in India that got shut down? I did not hear this. No. What happened? How many are we at? Are we at like four?
Triple? No. I think I haven't gotten a triple on stream yet. It's short. The state. I, I still don't know what you're talking about. In Indiana. In Indiana. Sorry. No, I didn't. What happened? Will this work? Oh, that was so goaded. That was so fast. That was so fast. Ruins. Okay, we just need the bonus. Come on. Wait, Zigzagoon isn't set. Zigzagoon isn't set! Oh, fuck. Get lucky. Get lucky. Get lucky. Get lucky! It wasn't set. Should've paid attention. No. <laughs> All we have to do is get Jirachi. Now we're getting a Reggie Rock. That'll work. That is cool. This actually isn't a terrible run. It's not good in terms of, like, speedrunning records. But it's not bad, in all things considered, especially with a fishing rod. I just need to hit that zigs again. I like Reggie Rock, but I'm here for Jirachi. That's why I'm here. We gotta get that Zigzagoon set up, though. Okay, I could try to do like. Hmm. The reverse nut. He does. No! <laughs> no! The reverse nut was for nothing! And he gets it back. Just like that. It's fine. It's been fine. It's always been fine. Oh, I could have saved that. I could have saved that. I could have saved that too. Okay, I can use this. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Don't hit that zig. We just gotta get Jirachi. We just gotta get it. We have 30 seconds. Good. Good. One more. Oh, it was almost free. It was almost free. Got it. Got it. That would be time. That would have been time. We did it! With a fishing rod! Let's keep it running. Let's keep it running. Let's keep it running. We did it, baby! Jirachi percent with a fishing rod. Fuck it, let's do the bonus. Let's kick Dusclops' ass with a fishing rod. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. 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 Look at the, look at him play. Look at him just play some fucking pinball. And not hit that other ghost. Get tricked by that other ghost. <laughs> Someone should submit the speedrunning record. We didn't have a timer though. So I'm gonna have to do some calcs. I think it officially starts when you hit the speed of the game. There's no shot, though, that the uh, that speedrunning.com or whatever it is would accept that. <laughs> Even if you were like, it's a whole new run, it's with a fishing rod. Because nobody else has done it and can do it, has access to it. Okay, we still got a minute. This was in perfect time, but that's fine. Or maybe less. No, we're good. That's okay. Just went out so quickly, Chris. At least the source. What happened? You didn't explain what happened. You're just like, it's gone. What happened? 
Good. Just gotta get him while he's walking, like here. No, I went too. I was too. I was too quick with it. I was. I, I pre-nutted. Shit. That was good. That was bad. Shit. Shit. Good. Done. Let's get Rayquaza with the fishing rod. Why don't we do that? Why don't we make that our goal? First Jirachi ever finished legitimately. The first real Jirachi percent. The first real one. Rod Quaza. That sounds like a, a guy who would write a children's book would be, would be named that. Okay, I gotta get back used to getting used to the bumper. Let's see if we can pull something with this. Catch em all mode is kind of useless on this map. Because you can't get evolution Pokemon, but you can get cool Pokemon. We take those. Hatch would be actually be pretty good right about now. So why don't I do this? Why don't I do one of these and go for a hatch? With a fishing rod. He, he could do that with a fishing rod. He could get his feel with the fishing rod. There's a power outage. And then, hang on, I need to wait for it to pop on the other screen. Then they evacuated people to be safe in Indiana. How did the power outage happen though? Like what happened? What the hell happened? Just went out? It's Pilk! <laughs> we got Pilk! <laughs> Indiana's these nuts. It doesn't even work! Rayquaza percent is hard. That's hard too. That's real hard. That's a difficult one. It would be kind of hard, though. Like, the other way around, it would be kind of hard. Shit. No, go up the Evo! I want an Evo Bilk! I want a, a, a Walrus Bilk! Join that server, baby! Join that server! Join in! Get that shit. Where'd you find that rod controller? Alarok made it. Alarok created it. And sent it to a fet A FedEx. And I grabbed it from the FedEx. It is custom. It is the only one in the world. It is sick, right? It is Oh, fuck it, we'll travel. It is dope. This is really cool. What am I doing? I just, I just like blacked out for a second. I just went like no brain for a second. I was just like... It's kind of crazy. Damn it! Okay. Do we want to try to get a Rayquaza with this? Is that our goal now? Is that our goal? Oh, good cloth. Enjoy your night. It is. It is very impressive. It's super impressive. What I really like about it is it's a member of chat who's like, I can do that. And then they prove it. They prove it. They stand by it and they're like, I made it. I'm sending it to you. <laughs> play Minecraft? Oh, to go play Minecraft. All good, enjoy Minecraft. Do we want to do a, uh, a Rayquaza percent? How do you even do the Rayquaza percent? Isn't it like all bonuses and evolutions? It's true, you do have the plaque. You could send that to the FedEx. That could work. If you didn't already ignore it. Apparently a wire went down. 
I, I'm, I'm not reading it. The rod was made to catch Feebas. Now we're using it to catch Jirachi and Pinball. This is true. I'm gonna see if we can do... I can't remember which one we want. I can't remember if Ruby's better or Sapphire's better, but people do it on both. Why don't we just stick with Sapphire because we're just playing it? If you wanted to do a Dr uh, Rayquaza percent, it goes something like this. It's like... It's like you get here. You gotta do it right. <laughs> you get it here. And you just gotta bounce it up and try to get as many bonuses as you can. And get a little lucky. I think it is easier in Sapphire because you can utilize Zigzagoon here too. I think the trick is like you have to like use one of the side bumpers, side tilts, and then hit up tilt, like spam it until you can get the uh, bonus. Shit, not like that. Perhaps like that though. Perhaps like that. That, that does not do it. Latias saves your balls? Yes! This is what the movie was inspired on. This game. Peanut Gallery, good night! Sleep good. Okay, this will work. This will work. There's a bonus. What they usually do is they go for coins, and they are perfect, frame perfect with it. Like, every time it's just coins, and then evos and uh, catches. Everything they do on these is like frame perfect, though. And I don't know how to do that. How to make a fishing rod. That would be cool. It can't be simple. It cannot be simple considering there's like custom screens on this thing that tracks the amount of feedbacks we have and has like an ad at the front that's like, this was made by the, the, the Chin's fishing company. How, how do they do that? How do they get it from there to the, to the actual whole things? How do they do that? Uh-oh. Aqua, welcome back. I think you missed us getting Jirachi with the controller. Honestly, it didn't take that long. I thought it was going to take way longer. Shit, I fucked it up. What shell? Xavier Renegade Angel? I'm worried it's gonna turn into a D's nuts to be like Exa Xavier Renegade Angel Angel Where would you go with that? You can go somewhere and it makes me nervous. Shit. This shit's hard. Yeah, we did already get Jirachi. Already did it. I'm telling you, I'm getting good at that Jirachi run. I just need to, I just need to warm up is all I gotta do, and then it's over. It's over. Jirachi percent over. Clock me out, boss. Get dirty at the Jirachi run. It's a real thing? Oh, then I, no, I don't know what it is. To answer that. Why don't we have a whale shark Pokemon? That's a good question. Why aren't there more shark Pokemon in general? Like, there's Sharpedo, what else? Kyogre? It's not really a shark. Oh, catch him. The thing is, I could just be going for catches and it would probably be easier for me. Hot tub stream. I, I, I'm not, it's not the end of the world for me, right? That's not the end of the world. Like, I, I would survive a hot tub stream. It wouldn't be the worst thing ever. I could get away with that. Pokemon channel for the GameCube? What is this? What f what area are we in? 
I guess we'll find out. It's a Maku Hitter. You can evolve that at least. A hot tub stream is not that hype. It's not that hype. People who love those and, and coom to those, it's really not that hype. Wasting your time. There's better things you could put on. You hear me? Well, I hear what? That you're playing Minecraft? Or did you say something else that I missed in the chat? Oh, oh I didn't realize I had the six again. 20k, we get to play test Chrysocola. We've played it on stream before, it's just not done. It's not done. Look, if I can get these views back up and I can get these editors paid, then I will devote way more time to Chrysocola. Way more. I've considered too. I have considered both doing like streams where I edit Chrysocola, which makes me nervous just because of Nintendo and the way Nintendo is. I've also considered doing video editing streams. Which would mean I'd do more streams in general, because I just do my editing while I'm doing streams, but I talk about how to do edits like I do. Like, for example, the one where I turn into an old man in my first video, the Chrysocola one. So I know a lot about editing, I just don't always do good editing. Catch! The audio sucks on those because of the splashing. I just want to hear them fucking. <laughs> I just want to hear them fuck. Why is there- are we- we must be in the cave. If it's Shelgen. We already got a Salamence once, I think. It's still hype. That wasn't just your real face. No, I, I, I don't have the ability to age rapidly. That'd be kind of sick. Could have gone to a lot of movies when I was a kid. A fun one off. Literally just people in hot tubs. Exactly. If you want a coom, just go somewhere else. I can see myself now. It's not, it's not you, Wes. I'm right here. <laughs> I, I can see it on the screen now. I don't have the pokey tracker up. Okay, Evo is not worth it right now. What we want is a catch or a hatch. That was crazy. It just stopped it like that. I've never seen it do that. Chris is young. Thank you. Finally, someone says it. Someone fucking says it. Oh no, the Evo's open. Oh, and he loses. I'm gonna make an offer to you, chat. Do you want to keep doing this, or do you want to look at, like, embarrassing stories and, uh, some other form stuff? I was that one guy who made a shell gun out of snow instead of a normal snowman. That's hype, though. That's hype. We could look at, uh, some form stuff, if you guys want to. Press trans. Become trans. Do other stuff. Let's do a boat. Do you want forms or more pin rod? After a round. As long as it makes you happy. I'm here for content. I'm here to make content. I serve you. I am here to serve you. I love pinning my rod. Looking swole? Thank you. Thank you very much. It's a tie. More pin rod just took the lead. I'll give it like 10 more seconds. I do kind of want to try it with this. I'm drinking a high noon. 
It's okay tonight. Lots of dying. That's not good news for me. What was that? Everyone like this stream. Do it now. If you haven't done it, do it now. It's a 50-50, fellas. Not many have voted, but it's a 50-50. Let's do one more run. Let's do one more run and see how we do. Oops. One more and we'll do forms. Liking for the pin rod. I'm here for the pin rod. Can I legally change my name to Pinrod? Did that sound different? What the fuck? What? What is with the sound effects? What happened? Dice. What do you mean dice? Puchiana. Up. Easy. For Speed J. I still have to, uh, tomorrow I'm probably gonna put in the order for all the items and get all the dates on them. So I still have to do that. Let me go. Fuck it, fuck it. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Get... Let me go! <laughs> Let me leave. Let me leave. This is, uh, if you're actually doing the speed run, that's like your worst nightmare. Well, we sort of doing the speed run. We got a Poochiena and a Master Ball. It's worth it. This game with voice commands? That would be a nightmare. It'd be crazy. Infinite points, though. That is true. That is true. Where are all the What is going on with the sound effects? Why? <laughs> Why are all the sound effects fucked? Also, if we get this Evo, um, then we don't have to worry about, like, two more catches. That just brings us directly to, uh, uh, the bonus, which is what we want. And he doesn't clutch it. It's making me really uncomfortable that the sound effects aren't quite working right. It's making me very, very uncomfortable. You don't have to donate money towards that. That's okay. I can just get it. What I want to do, though, is I want to find a creative way to play it. Because my goal is to, with at least, like, 80, 90% of things I do on stream, is do it in a creative and different way. Because at any time, you could find a really interesting playthrough of uh, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, Vanilla or Nuzlocke or whatever. My goal is you see me play it, it's weird. Something's not right. Audio channels disabled in MGBA? I don't think so. It's probably like... I'm assuming that there's like a... Uh, since there's a limit on the sound hardware on a GBA. Or an emulation of a GBA. There's probably some sound effect that's like volume zero that's playing. And fucking things up. Like a GBA... Uh, a Game Boy Color sound or something. Because it seems like it's like the sound effects that were related to like... 8-bit noises. Like, that would have been built with 8-bit noises. You can only use magic card. But what if we did, like, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, Bite Only? What if we did that? I've never played the damn game before. Good. You just rip it? Don't say that online. <laughs> In public. Cannot say yes to that. It sounds like the sound effects are working again. Something was clogging that channel. What do we want? Coin? Sure. Buy it only, you madman. I've been trying to build it for black and white, and I've been having a lot of trouble with it. Also, I don't really want this evolution. It's kind of a waste. Shit! Seto, welcome back. Buy it in metronome only. Metronome just serves to be like torture. 
Like Bide, you can probably come up with a strategy and make it work, and it's just like a big puzzle. Metronome, however, is just torture. It's just slow. It's just slow torture. I've never been interested in doing a run of it. I know I implemented it in Chrysocola for like a like a type of Battle Frontier kind of thing. I know I did that, but I, like I, I've played it in Chrysocola and it's torture. <laughs> It's very hard because there's nothing you can do. I think it's been done a lot of times too. By uh, other other YouTubers. Like a lot of times. What did Shao write? I can't see it because I'm trying to focus. What did he write? Sucks off the guy who's currently streaming. Ah. Cleans off mouth. Thanks. It was better than yesterday. <laughs> that is one of the craziest things I think I've ever read in this chat. <laughs> Sucks off the guy. Oh, that was so good. That was better than yesterday. Why do I keep coming back here? Good lord. Okay, uh, these are bad places these dust skulls are in, but I don't care. I'm still gonna get them, like so. Good, good. Did you what, pineapple? Did you eat pineapple? <laughs> I don't, I don't want to tell my secrets, my day-to-days. Shit. As long as I can keep it over a minute, I'm happy. Before this dust collapse comes out, but it's not looking good. Of course. Of course. Of course. This one's gonna disappear too. I have to say, this is one of the coolest mini games, I think. Not oh, that was clean. Not only in concept, but all the music and little sound effects and stuff, and the art is really nice here. Okay. Start walking, you big clown. And I waited too long. Good. That's fine. That was clean. That was clean. It's fine. You beat the Invisible Dude game? What is the Invisible Dude game? How do you catch that? You piece of shit. You piece of shit. Is that, uh, the Kecleon? Oh, yeah, 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 it is. It is. That one's harder. That one's harder because it's, it's just painful. Because, like, if you just... Uh, if the Sylph Scope's in a bad place and you're just missing the Kecleon, it's really frustrating. The magic of Pinrod. The magic that is... Pinrod. See what I mean, though? See what I was saying? Like, we could do Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. We could be like, oh, yeah, it's like Abra only. Or we could do Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon, but the controller's set up, so if you guys redeem, all of the buttons change. All of the inputs change. Oh, and I don't know what that means, but hello, I haven't talked to you in a while, bud. I hope you're doing good. I have no idea what that means, though. Not a clue. Alright, let's get that Evo. Come on. Come on, baby. Give me the Evo. I can do catch two, though, because it's only one. Harder to Nuzlocke than every, nearly every mainstream difficulty ROM hack. Interesting. Very interesting. Are you guys like in a voice chat or something? What are you up to? Okay, do this. No. No. <laughs> I 
I don't want the baby alien. Fucking, fucking stupid. Okay. Okay. No, no, no. Focus, 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 focus. Be calm. Be cool. Be collected. Be normal. And cool. And chill. And vibing. Perfect. Perfect. Beautiful. 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 You're playing Dark Souls? Good luck to ya. What's your... I, I don't know. I don't know what that means. If you want, I can make all major fights in Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon and have some variation on Cynthia's team. That'd be a cool one. I've never played the game, though, so I think the ideal thing would be first to let you guys see me play the game, even if it's wacky, but I actually think that would be a really cool run. I like both music tracks a lot. Sapphire's mechanics are really cool and they're easier to play. But I like all the music in this whole game. The music is great in this game. I still really want to remix the Mart theme from this game and put it in Chrysocola. I should have gone for the Pokemon. I'm pretty sure you get a starter by doing it that way too. Sure, fuck it. Where's the first one? I didn't see it. Right there. Shit. All Pokemon random, but they all have max IVs and EVs and can only use your starter. So it's a starter only and all Pokemon are potentially as powerful as they can be. Look, fellas, 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 if you have ideas for stuff like this, too, we have a forum for it right now. We have a forum for your ideas in the Discord. Oh, and I've been pretty good. I'm very tired today because I tried skiing. And I fell a lot. It hurt my bomb. Pop Leo is objectively the best starter. It's not the- it's not Incineroar? Uh, wouldn't it be Incineroar? Uh, it's just based on competitive knowledge, I have no idea. Come on, get to the- get to the fucking Mart. Get to the fucking Mart. Pablo's lame. Objectively, it's lame, dude. There we go. There we go, baby. Let's reel this fucker in. Mighty Anna, that, I think... Did we catch something a second ago? That might bring us to the bonus or not at all. I might be wrong. Does not. We need to catch something. We could get a uh, catch right here, though. No, we can't. Hi, Owen. Oh, wait, it's already active. What am I doing? Pre Marina has the best spread. Gross. And typing. And single player. And Incineroar is better online. I guess that makes sense. I guess that makes sense. Monkey baby. Decidueye is the worst in both. That's a shame. That's a shame. Decidueye is really cool compared to the other two, I think. One is just a big wrestler cat, and the other one is stupid. Coolest in concept, but worst in execution. It is a shame. It's a damn shame. You hate to hear it. You hate to hear it. You love to see it. You love to see it, but you hate to hear it, and you hate to use it. He was almost good. He was almost goaded there. He was al more almost goaded there. 
The fuck? Come on. You know what? Maybe I should stop going for the trick play. No luck in Feebas. It was the worst luck today. We had six resets before we ever got to the pond. It went horribly. I think today was a good stream, though. It was a shorter Feebas than usual. Mostly because I told my little story about my, my week here. And then we did the background contest. It was a fun stream. Overall. <laughs> I'm right. I'm right. It was gross. It was gross, okay? It was, it was gross. <laughs> don't, don't then say that to me. Don't then go like, yeah, but you're right. But yeah, like, yeah, it's true. Best spread, for sure. I should just call the title of the stream Pinrod. Alright, let's make this a quick, easy Kyogre. The only trick here is to play smart and hit it right before it's going to do its stupid little ice beam thing. I don't, I don't want to think about the slack off yet. <laughs> he does have a bit of a booty though on him. I will give you that. You do. He does have visible booty. Oh, he canceled it. It's fine. Oh, this hurts my hands. This hurts my hands with this controller. Ah. Oh! People were vicious today. It was extremely vicious. I don't know what was going on, but it was vicious as hell today. Crashing the game and all. This is going bad. It's alright though. Watch this. Just kidding. That's fucked up. <laughs> Arthritis gaming hour. Welcome, Zinzinix. Welcome. Fucking ow. Ugh. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All we gotta do is play smart here. Hit him once, right before he's gonna attack. He's gonna, ah, uh, fuck, I fucked it. I didn't play it smart. Ficious. That is actually fair. That is actually fair. Ow! The music does go hard, it is dark, it is tense. Ow! I can't believe that worked. Okay, slow it down. Slow it down. Like that. Boom. Like that. Shit. Come back. Come back. Fucking god damn it. This is going horribly. I wonder if it is like a remix of the legendary theme from Pokemon. It's hard to tell. It's got like the timpani and all that. This, in theory, other than, like, er, killing my thumbs, shouldn't be that hard even with this controller. I think I'm just playing bad right now. Like, I should be able to do this and stop it. There we go. And slow it down and wait for this to get out of the way and do one of... Shit. This music gets almost as hard as myself. Good. No, that's, that's what I wanted to read. Thank you for that. Thanks for that one. Beautiful. Shit! Rotating reel for the flippers would be so hard. Because the button click on the flipper, like on this thing itself, it's like, here's a click, here's a click, here's a click. It's not like you just turn and it clicks. It's not like as soon as you turn. It'd be so hard to time. But we could try it. I don't see why not. I have to make some edits to the controller settings right quick, but I could do that. I could do that if we want to do that. I didn't know you lurked. Damn. Uh, we have an Evo mode. I hope we get it. We don't have a Zigzagoon. Damn. All good, Nicole. All good.
Be bold. Yeah, it's a shame. That's the other thing. You could do, like, if you wanted to do two really interesting buttons for the flippers, it would be impossible. It would be actually impossible to do because of the way the thing works. But, you could do, like, right is this and left is cast. <laughs> but the cast, like, you would never get the left bumper. It would never happen. You would never, ever be able to time that and get it to click when you want it to click. And your arms would be broken. <laughs> Look, after I get this Pokemon right here, or this uh, travel or whatever, I can nice set up call. like the right flipper. I can set up like the right flipper to be uh, the, the this thingy. Motion controls of the Game Boy with Kirby. That is really cool. Chow, what are you up to? <laughs> what are you guys up to? Shake tied to the actual shake function. Well, there's three inputs for the shake function, so you can only do one of them. You could probably do like up and it would be the most useful would be painful. If you did like a Jirachi percent with uh, with the shake function, it would be a nightmare. With the actual cast. Alright, what are we gonna evolve? We're gonna evolve Magnemite. Fuck it. Good. Good. We got a bonus coming up if we don't die. And this is the worst spot to get it. But we can get it. Imagine shaking your Pikachu in real life. We got it. Easy. Let's go. Let's go. Alright. Uh, we have two, so we want to catch... Maybe we can get it with the slot, with the Zigzagoon. If we're lucky. Or like that. Up. Uppies. Uppies. Good. Give me a catch. Or go to bonus, we take those. We take those. You're at that stage of hair growth. We have to shave it all off. Le wait, what? Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta focus for a second, hang on. Oh, my guts just like blew up. You simultaneously wanna shave it all off and let it grow to double the size. I recommend grow it first. Try growing it. See if you like it. If you don't like it, you can shave it all off. Boom. Because then if you already have decently long hair, then it's not double the weight to try both. Problem solved. Problem solved. It's like one thirsty person and one person who needs to pee. Two birds with one stone. Very simple. I'm not getting this under a minute. Or over a minute. Or are we? Nope. Game makes you feel like you're in the pinball region of the world. It is cool. It is very cool. This game is hugely, enormously underrated. Easy. Easy dusk. Long for winter, shape for summer. That is fair to do as well. Fuck! Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Start walking. Easy. 
Alright, now we just gotta get a Kyogre and then get a Rayquaza. I want to say Rayquaza is one try, but it might be two tries. You might have to do it twice. I can't remember. Evo? Evo? Never mind. He's a bald version of himself. The only way I'd ever try going bald is if I did like this full time, because then it would be for the funny. And I'd be doing this full time, so it's not like I'd have like a social life. Because I look weird bald. Bro sauce, definitely. It's just worse, Chris. It would be like when you guys had me shave before. You guys would just want me to put it back. You guys would just be like, this was a mistake. Put it back. What did you do? I didn't mean to do that. Marketing. I went bald. And the thumbnail is me uh, in a hospital bed. Begging for strands of hair on the street. You need to make a toupee of what you cut off? I could sell my hair. You do a giveaway. Give away my hair. Never go full time stream, go bald for the bit. I will. If we can do that, if we can do that, I'll go bald. There's your incentive. There's your incentive. Like, share, like, share, like, share. I will go bald. There's nothing good in this. You want my hair? <laughs> I would kill to have his hair in a jar. I want his hair in a jar so I can put it up on my shelf. I don't want the travels! But you are bald. Shit, I wasn't looking. Shao would totally buy your hair. Shao doesn't have to. I see Shao at least once a year. Shao could just cut it off while I'm sleeping and take it. He doesn't have to buy it. There's no need to buy it. He very well could have cut off a strand of my hair and taken it when I'm sleeping, and I wouldn't know. He could be collecting that shit. I wasn't paying attention. I was thinking about my hair being cut off in my sleep. Well, that's a dead run. Ugh. Do we want to go to forms? My hands are starting to really hurt. Collects hair from all his friends and plans to wear them all on a necklace. I could go bald as a bit on stream and then make a wig out of all of my friends' hair. Forms? Let's see if there's any more embarrassing stories, because I love reading those. I love reading those. Let's find out. Let's fuck around and find out. Whoops, whoops, whoops. A wig of all my friends' hair would go crazy. I'd have so many different colors and varieties. And straight and curly. It would go hard. Let's see what we got. Let's check the most embarrassing stories and your ROM hack ideas. We have six new stories. And I don't know how many new ideas. I'm just going to jump to like 60 on the idea ones or something. I know unknown left a comment saying unknown left the, or, or, or excuse me, read the form incorrectly. So there's some ideas from unknown that are like full games. That's fine. We're just going to move past them, I think. Oh, my guts are going absolutely crazy. What would it smell like? It would smell like flowers. Depending on a hair color, the average person has between 90,000 and 150,000 hairs on their head. One for each chatter. <laughs> one, one hair for each of my followers if we get to 150k. Okay. I think we read this one. 
So let's pull up this one and let's show it to the stream, baby. Okay. All right. What's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you? One time as a kid. Holy shit, my camera freaked out. One time as a kid, I went to a theme park with my family. I had to pee, but my brothers really wanted to go on a roller coaster. So I held in my piss until we got to the very top. And I had the amazing idea to just piss on the railing of the ride, hoping nobody would notice. And they did. It also accidentally dripped down hey, yo, what the fuck? onto a weird satanic couple who kept on yelling at me. What the fuck were you thinking? <laughs> if, it's, if it's like a roller coaster, you're in line. You can have your brother or somebody else save your place in the line. You don't have to piss on the railing. <laughs> you don't have to take your cock and ball out and start pissing everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I it's embarrassing but it's at like your own accord it's your own fault <laughs> it's like I, if you're a kid you do dumb things it's just a thing that kids do but my days come on man <laughs> you would clone Chris and then freak it with <laughs> I would clone Chris and freak it with them. What's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you? So when I was a lot younger, I'd just been in sport, and there was an awful smell. I thought it was just all the kids sweating, but people kept accusing me of shitting my pants. I denied it, and sat down with the rest of the kids in the shaded area. You could hear a squelch. I had just sat in the wet grass. However, I was wearing really thin shorts, and a tiny bit of water wet my shorts, which became transparent in the back. You could see my underwear, and they were... <laughs> and they were caked in shit. I got called Shardy Face for the next ten weeks. <laughs> that sucks. That fucking sucks. <laughs> That's... That's one of the worst things that can happen to you as a kid. You just shit your pants. And it just happens to kids. It can. You eat something bad in the cafeteria, you have food poisoning, you're gonna shit your pants. <laughs> and there's evidence. I've heard worse, though. I knew a kid who shit his pants on the playground and it came out of his shorts as little nuggets. And there were kids throwing rocks at each other as they do. And my brother picked up one of the turds thinking it was a rock and threw it at a kid's eye. <laughs> the kid started screaming and uh, my brother got sent home. <laughs> so it could be worse. It could be much worse. Because not only did my brother get sent home for throwing shit like a monkey. And another kid got shit in his eyeball. But another kid shit his pants... And it came out of his shorts. And I don't know who should be most embarrassed. Probably that third kid. But none of them had a good time. They call him Rock Eye. I don't think they made fun of that kid. I think they made fun of the kid who shit his pants. He'd moved schools. <laughs> Next. So when I was like four or something, I would always do what I was told. Someone told me to kick someone. The first person was a man in a wheelchair, and I kicked him in the balls. Oh! Why did you do that? What? I... Okay, wait. There might be one positive side to the story. There is the chance. The coin flip. That he didn't feel it. Exactly, Bagel. He didn't feel it. He might not have felt it. It might not have bothered him. He might have just been like, what the fuck? Hey. <laughs> Marcelo, welcome from the McDonald's drive-thru. Get something fucking good. 
Get some good food. Whoever did that, you're a monster. Yeah, I don't know if that's embarrassing or just admitting to something evil. I mean, you could probably feel shame about that, and that's pretty much the same thing. But I, I don't know if there are people watching based on the details. I mean, someone told you to kick someone, so they probably saw it. And they were probably like, what the fuck? Why'd you kick the guy in the wheelchair in the balls? So maybe it was embarrassing. I don't know. I was trying out some drama in middle school and had nothing prepared for the audition. I showed up and just did improv based on what everyone else before me said and didn't get into whatever it was. <laughs> uh, that's cringy. Uh, you show up, you don't even know what you're performing for and you just do something. Your best. That's, that's cringy. That's embarrassing. That hurts. That hurts. Ugh. It is kind of theater kid energy, though, to show up to the theater performance and just do what you do. You're gonna crush a quarter pounder? Let's go. Let's fucking go. It is very theater kid to do that. But God, is it cringy. This is not nice. That is not a nice thing to write. I live in Massachusetts, and there's this big test everyone has to take called MCAS, and it's kind of stinky, but whatever. I go to the bathroom before we begin the test, and when I'm using the urinal, two kids walk in. They're some of those cool kids or popular kids, but are actually really mean and or annoying for no reason. And one of them just stands behind me, like two inches behind me, and the other one is just laughing. I could tell he was there. But, like, I was peeing, so I didn't say anything, and I feel like they would beat me up, so I just left. I mean, yeah, it's embarrassing, but they're more like they're jerks. Yeah, I, I don't think it's, like, as embarrassing. It's literally just those people were mean. You should never talk to those people again. They're probably not going to really get anywhere. Like, if they're just messing with you while you're peeing, that's just shitty. That's just being shitty. That's when you power spin. That's when you get bulked up. You get beefcake mode, yoked up. And you show up at their house and start playing with their wiener while they're peeing. Go, ah, stop. Were you a helicopter? Do the Mozart bit again? <laughs> no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. We already did it once. Today. Actual anime music? It's, it is from Yu-Gi-Oh. You got a perfect score on the math MCAS in third grade. You're a nerd. You're a fucking nerd, dude. Next. This is less of an individual experience, but almost every day I overhear someone whisper things like young Sheldon looking, or he looks like he goes to church every Sunday. But yeah, it's not so embarrassing again as it is just someone's being mean to you. It's not cool. It's not cool. It's not cool of those people. Like, what if you do look like young Sheldon? So what? What if you are young Sheldon? So what, dude? So what? Own that. Own that shit. Ugh. Own it. Mozart was the original shardy face. They called him Mozart. He was! He ate shit. It's real. It's a real thing. You can look it up. It's on Wikipedia. He ate shit. What he thinks of Shardy Face? He is Shardy Face. It's true. Zen is right. Zen is true. This was my peak as a gifted child. It was all downhill from there. <laughs> Let's look at some of the ideas. Let's look at some of the ROM hack ideas. Wrote it a few years ago? I'll check it out after the stream. Hell yeah. Rhythm game. I think we looked at this one. Let's jump ahead until we see one we don't recognize. Did we look at this one? Yeah, we did. I think we did this.
Here we are. I think this is new. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Your Pokemon ideas. All right. This is for runs. This is for challenges. All right. If you submit to this form and you put in like fake Mon and you put in your custom characters and custom story and custom region, don't care. Don't want to see it. Not interested. Save them for your Poke Community hack. You can put them in our Discord, but I don't care to put them here. This is not for that. Some people did. They misread it. That's okay. Just don't do it. Anyways, Pokemon Devolution. You start really high level when the game is easy, but as the game gets hard, you lose levels and get weaker. Maybe we did already see this one. Um, I think it's a run people have done before, but it's a cool idea. Next. We saw this one. Hang on. Keep going ahead. Keep going ahead. Pokey lock. Okay. This one's new. Yeah, we want to do like a uh, a one-off of a bunch of these runs. Wanda, hello. Welcome. Welcome. It's a Nuzlocke simulator. Pick a region to play it and pick your personal rules. Pokey lock will lock these rules in after you confirm them. So be careful in your choosing. Rules to choose from include first encounter only, auto release, blah, blah, blah. blah. This is one of those ones that uh, we got an apology for from Unknown because he did it wrong. But I'll read it off. Shiny Claws. You can catch and use shiny Pokemon if you find one. Legendary Claws. Match the gym level. I think... Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. I want to say this exists. I think this exists. I think that there's like... Doesn't the Emerald upgrade have options you could turn on and off for a Nuzlocke? Hello, Joe Mega. There's a lot of new grounders in the chat. Hello. Welcome. How do you do a ROM incorrectly? It's it's the prompt is wrong. It's wrong to the prompt. Is they're supposed to be very simple? Hello, Seto. Hello, Blue Kirby. But yeah, I think this already exists. I think this kind of stuff already exists and is out there. It might not be as defined as this. It's a cool idea. Uh, it's just not the right one for the form. It's about to get new grounded. We, we've seen this one too, actually. Bardock versus Frieza. You have Hyper Beam and your opponent has Brave Bird. Goaded. Very good idea. Next. How many did we look through before? This has a Pokemon region. Gen 10 game Pokemon region. Every step speeds up the game is a great idea. We looked at this one. How many did we go through last time? The idea for this one is we're going to make a bunch of short ones and play them all. and see if the ideas are good for sure. You put yours in the form. That might be one we have not seen. We've seen this one. It's like curse. Is this one new? Monkey Run. Only Pokemon in the game are monkey Pokemon or adjacent to monkeys. This is fire. This is fucking fire. I like this. Everything is monk. It could have the monk type implemented from too many types. Next. Slow. You always move last in battle. In battle items will have no priority. Maybe do this as a Nuzlocke. That's a cool idea. That's a really cool idea. That's interesting. Having no speed control in the game, even for items and everything. So if you wanted to heal, if you wanted to use a healing item, they could still kill you before you use it. They could cancel it. That's a really cool idea. I don't know how you'd make that. It would have to be a uh, decomp, a disassembly. But I really like that idea. That's cool. That's a really interesting one. I don't know how hard it would be. I feel like it would be a burn nuzlocke tier where you think it's easy and then it's really hard. Pokemon open world. Everything's open world. This isn't simple, but it's possible to make like kind of quickly because um, it's not like a huge change. It's just kind of getting rid of all the flags. They did this for crystal already. I wonder if they've done this for other gens. Last regardless of priority brackets? I think so. I think that does include that. Like, quick attack still goes last. <laughs> have to be tanks? It would be. It would be a lot of stalling. It would be a lot of stalling. Dekachad do be having good ideas. 
They did it for Emerald too. I have to think of a different one. This would be a cool Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon one, maybe. I don't know. I haven't played the game. Pokemon Outnumbered Edition. Enemy trainers can have more than six Pokemon, and their team sizes keep getting larger as the game continues. First gym leader would have six, and the team sizes would increase by one or two after every gym. The champion would have the biggest team with either 15 or 24 Pokemon. Most regular trainers and team grunts should probably do one to two, two to three maximum team size, unless they're like a breeder who should have a full team. Boss battles will always have a full team. That's another cool one. That's another really cool one. I have no idea how to implement that. But that's cool as hell. 15 to 24 fucking Pokemon on the champion's team. It's like a gauntlet. I don't know how the fuck you would implement this. You could kind of pseudo implement it, kind of like the Komodo girls were like in uh 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 in Heart Gold and Soul Silver where it's just you battle over and over and over again. Could be done that way. Double what they already have. I just I'm just trying to figure out in my head how they would do it cuz you'd have to repoint everything if it's binary. You have to change a lot of shit about the engine. I don't know. Something I could think about a lot, but I think it would be really cool. Over a hundred total Pokemon. That's crazy. Beating a hundred Pokemon just to end the game. That's super cool. I think that's a great idea. Pokemon Carousel Edition. Every battle is a rotation battle. That's cool too. I feel like um you'd have to take it a step further. It would be a rotation battle and your Pokemon would be forced to rotate each time. That'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, it would be a struggle. Like, if you did this in Gen 3, I wouldn't even necessarily make it a rotation battle. I just have, like, two menus that it's, like, next Pokemon. So you were aware. Or even get rid of that. Or even get rid of it. Just make it so it just rotates. It's just a switch and then you battle. This is from, uh... I think this is from Breath of the Wild. I think this is Rito Village from Breath of the Wild, not Tears of the Kingdom. Unless it's the same track. I don't know if they reused it or not. I can't remember. Either way, I like that. That's a cool idea. Next. Pokemon, but you can only deal damage with Synchronize. I thought about doing this. I thought about a run like this. The only damage dealing move you can use is Synchronize. No abilities or status moves that can cause damage. The really hard part about this, because I was considering doing this run after the Frozen run, this was going to be my second run on the channel. <laughs> the hard part is like you can't force it to happen to you. You can't like you can't like use a flame orb or toxic orb or something. Like th this wasn't my idea. My idea wasn't synchronized. My idea was um using items. Only deal damage using items like rocky helmet and shit. <laughs> and I was thinking synchronized plus flame orb would be goaded, but unfortunately uh, that is not the case. That doesn't work. You can only use Umbreon with Synchronize. Umbreon would be one of the best Pokemon to use with Synchronize because it would just be like Umbreon, Espeon, Gardevoir, and like Alakazam or something. Pokemon, but you can only use Shiny Feebas and there's chat crowd control and you have to restart if chat ever sends a Shiny Feebas. <laughs> We're already doing that. We're already doing this, basically. Synchronize is an ability. Umbreon with Synchronize is useless? What do you mean? Oh, I guess in this run it is a damage dealing move. Wait. Synchronoise! Wait! This is different. I read this wrong. What does Synchronoise do? <laughs> I want this cold to go away. Damages all adjacent Pokemon that share at least one type with the user. If the user has multiple types, any Pokemon with those types will be damaged. Oh. Wait, why is this useless with the Umbreon then? Why is it useless? Like, it would still hit Dark types. Oh, it's a psychic type attack. 
That's why it's useless. That's brain dead to do that. Okay, that's still a really cool idea. That's still a really cool idea. I like that a lot. Every Pokemon only knows Synchro Noise. That's a very cool idea. I went on like a whole thing there too. I was like, here's my run idea I had and it had nothing to do with yours. <laughs> this is brain dead. We can end with Do She Love Me, but we're not there yet. We still have a few more uh, to go through here. Feebass, shiny hunt, but worse. Every time you encounter a Feebass, the Feebass tiles change. All of me wants to hit this button. All of me wants to hit this and make this go away, but I'll keep it in. Water is wet. Everything is water. The floor, the Pokemon, everything. Replace all Pokemon with fish. I thought it was going to say with water. I wonder if this has been done too. I wonder. Hit it. <laughs> this is, it's basically just Gen 3. It's just Hoenn. It's just Hoenn. It's not far off from Hoenn already. Yeah, Team Aqua won. Yeah. It's not all that far off from Hoenn. Pokemon, but my rival chases me. This is yours, Blue Kirby. I remember this. This is a really cool idea, I think. Using the Pathfinding AI from the Among Us MAGM, have a rival trainer chase you and battle you. Their team can transform to try and get advantage over you in your battles. If you lose, the run is over. If you win, you temporarily stun them. I like this idea a lot. A lot. I like it a lot. I think it's super cool in concept. Like, what, what it has to do, what it has to do, too, is, like, similar to the Among Us AI one, like, even when you're in a text dialogue box, he's still chasing you. So you have to play the game as fast as you can. Or his team could just destroy you. Like, going through Rock Tunnel or something like, or Victory Road with this would be a nightmare. It would take some heavy coding. It would take some heavy coding for sure. But it would be sick. It would be dope. Like, doing a Nuzlocke with this? Oh my god, that would be fucking content, baby. That would be content. That would be sick. No, if they walk through walls and over water, they'd be brain dead. I mean, water's fine. Water's fine, but walk through walls is brain dead. That's just unfair. Your palms would be sweaty. I love this idea. I love this. I'd like to look into this. Yeah, exactly. Rock tunnel. Be fucked. Bite my shiny metal ass. Bender from Futurama, but Pokemon. Good. No, that's that's a great idea. Wow. Okay. <laughs> All your Pokemon know transform and nothing else. They still get moves and stuff of their target. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Would it be, if Doc Breeb, I don't know if you're here, would it be, uh, would it be like you have imposter on all your Pokemon as like a second ability, or would it be you have to take a turn to use transform? Because if that's the case, you could just do like a team mirror thing. It would work the same. Pokemon that's a finished version of Chrysocola. <laughs> Music turned off using the same building. That's what I was saying last time. That's what I was saying last time. Is that could be like Saw X from uh, from Metroid Fusion and get all scary and tense. Basically Ditto Run. I mean, you could just do a Ditto Run. That's true. I think it's cool. I think it's cool. Acid Rain Run. In Gen 4, there was a glitch which would make every... Enable every weather at the same time. It would make it so you only get the downsides to sun and rain while taking chip from hail and rain sandstorm. Fog could be ignored while maybe adding terrains from Gen 7 Plus and all the spike items like stealth rock spikes and toxic spikes. If you had max like field stuff like stealth rock spikes, toxic spikes, plus sandstorm hail. Would that just, like, basically kill you in one turn? 
Like, would that just bring you down to red in one turn? And poisoned? This is a really cool idea. I love the idea of, like, permanent acid rain. I love that in itself, where it's just the weather. I think that's super cool. I'm wondering if this would be, like, too much. It could be implemented. It could be tested. I wonder if it's too much, though. One eighth from weather. It is one eighth, but with acid rain. I guess it depends on the gen, right? One sixteenth per sand inhale. Is that in every gen? I thought it was like one eighth in the other games, but I might be wrong, like in older games. I don't know. But this would take somewhere from like a fourth to a half minimum. Plus poison. I don't know. I think it's worth trying with all these field effects and the acid rain. And then doing them separate. I think it's a really cool idea. I think it's very cool. Pokemon, but you have diarrhea. You can only walk a certain number of steps through the entire game. If you run out of steps, you shit yourself in the game softlocks. <laughs> That's good. This is good stuff. This is the stuff I really wanted to see. This is the stuff I really wanted to see. <laughs> this is why I made this form to begin with. I wanted this. <laughs> You'd have to like set... Here's how it would work, right? You wouldn't do like a certain number of steps to the entire game, I think. You wouldn't do like a... Because then you could just figure it out really early and reset. I think you'd have to do it location to location. Like a flag sets and it resets your step counter to a number. Like badge one would reset it to a fair number between uh, the cities for badge one and badge two. So that way, if you fuck up, it, it's like a, it's like a, oh shit, uh. Or maybe there's more things to it because then, even then, like if you knew you got screwed. Every time you heal the poke center, it resets. That's a good idea. It's kind of like the poison run, though, right? It's similar. Every badge your step counter extends your step counter. It's interesting, too. Take a laxative and see how far you get before your pants brown. <laughs> it's just RNG. It's just anywhere from one step to fucking 1,000, 10,000, 50,000. That's kind of a funny idea, actually. That's a really easy idea to implement. You just set a variable that goes with the step counter to a random number, and when it hits zero, it soft locks the game. <laughs> so you never know. You never know. That's a funny fucking idea. Professor Oak feeds you a laxative at the title screen, at the intro to the game. And you start, it says... You have an unknown number of steps before you shit yourself. <laughs> yeah, I like not knowing. I like not knowing. I like a little RNG to it. That adds a lot. That's a funny idea. And the last one. Pokemon Emerald Point Lock. In order to put input into the game, chat has to redeem 100 points for one input. I think chat would hate that, but I think it's funny. I think it's a funny idea. It would be interesting to do like a Twitch uh, plays Pokemon kind of thing where it just runs like on a channel. And then as you put points in from watching it, uh, you can make things happen. You get like a chance to uh, do a button press of your choice. You could do that too, actually. You could just set up a bunch of redeems that are like webhooks or something. And each one is relative to a button on the Game Boy. And uh, 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 if you redeem like A, it presses A through an API or something. Do I have a Twitch? I don't. I have a Twitch channel that's Hey PC, but I don't use it. I thought about multi-streaming, but I just haven't done it. I feel like I don't. I don't know Twitch culture well enough, and we have like a we have kind of a culture going here, and it doesn't mix. So I just haven't. I haven't hit the go button on it. Where is Ace Attorney? We do need to do that. We do need to do that. But it is almost one in the morning. 
Um, here's what I'm thinking. There's a possible chance we might not be able to do Minecraft with Avir and Doc Breeb next week. Have them teach me how to play. Either way, we could just do it after that. Or during that time slot if they can't do it that week. So we can, we can kind of feel that out. We can feel the water on that one. Yeah, we can do your damn douchey love me. <laughs> Fine. Fine. We can do it. Shit, you guys were able to claim coins that whole stream. That's not good. That's bad. And it's still pinned. I'm an idiot. I'm a dumbass. All right, let's set it up. Let's set it up. I didn't even realize that it was displaying on the screen. It doesn't really matter, but whatever. <laughs> wait, wait, what? We're not doing a Smasher Pass stream. Keep me updated, Dog Breed. All right, just let me know. Instead of Feebass, I'm going to send nonstop Vaporeon. That's a nightmare. That is a nightmare waiting to happen. Zinzinix is from Newgrounds.com. All right. All right, chat. All right, chat. Let me make sure I have Streamlabs ready to go here. Make sure I'm good to go on this end. But if you have not seen Do She Love Me before, if you've not seen Do She Love Me, I'm going to start the bet now. This is Mario 64 DS. Okay? Mario 64 DS. There's a game on Mario 64 DS. You might have seen it before. Why is there 10 squats? Okay. It looks like this. All right? Why is everything messed up on this screen? Fuck that. It looks like this. Okay? I'm going to be picking flowers, like so, petals off of this little flower here, okay? She loves me, she loves me not. You are going to bet if she loves me or loves me not. That's all I got to do. It's a coin flip. The problem is that I am not going to let you see. You cannot see what I'm going to pick. You don't know what I'm going to pick. It's a surprise. So, chat, let me ask you this. Do she love me or do she not? The bet is open now. You can use your balls anywhere from 10 to 10,000 to bet on this coin flip. There are three bets in right now. 12,873 balls are in the pot. I will keep it open for about a minute. What are you thinking? What are you thinking, Chad? Do she love me or do she not? Yes or no? What are we looking at right now? 24,000 balls in the pot. Most people are picking yes. And I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Why wouldn't she love me? I'm great. I'm great. It's like great fashion sense and like like cool and like tough and like beefy and like yoked it's like people see me and they're like he seems super chill I would chill with him he seems so chill right now we're looking at a very solid 40,000 balls in the pot most still picking yes about 64% of you I will give it about mm, 10 more seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Get your final bets in. Get your final bets in now. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Yes or no? Exclamation point bet. All right, I'm closing it. I'm closing it. I'm closing it. It's closed. Fellas. We're going to find out right now. 
do she love me or do she not? She loves me. She loves me not. 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 She loves me. Ooh. Oh. Fellas. Fellas, it's a no. It's a no. She doesn't love me. Which means... Yeah, yeah, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. She's fucking stupid. What is she, brain dead? She's fucking dumb. Around 35% of you are right this time. 35% of you got some damn balls. There's a cooldown on the boo. Everyone like this stream, you don't have a choice. Do it for me. Do it for me. But you know what? It's fine. Fuck her. Who cares? She sucked. I think that's gonna about do it for tonight. I'm quite tired. I'm starting to get sore from skiing. Nice car. But I think today was a pretty damn good stream. I think we did a lot. Got to talk about a funny little story. We got to do the background contest, which I will update tonight. The background will go up after stream. Shout out to DekaChad who won tonight's background contest for the month of February. Brand new background for the month. We had a horrible Feebass run. We beat Jirachi percent with a fishing rod playing pin rod. Pinball. We played a little more pinball. We looked at the forms and we did Do She Love Me. It was a pretty full stream today. Effer, I barely know her. We got a shiny hunt shaman. Damn. Damn. Needs to be as peak as possible. I hope we get some cool ones. I hope we get some cool ones. I'm stuffed. Nobody look at the current one? Take a look at it now. This is your last chance. You forgot the background form? I forgot it? Oh, to look at it? I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it and let some more come in. If you mean the new one for March. SKD, hello. We're wrapping things up here. <laughs> is the end of the stream but hopefully hopefully the next video the one hp run video will be out soon i'm just still waiting on some things to get approved this shirt is not purple you are you, you need help you need glasses <laughs> hopefully that won't be out soon if it's not that it will be a veers rom hack it will be a veers magm next and perhaps after that maybe some story time stuff i don't know Hopefully it's 1 HP first. I spent a lot of hours on that. But that's it. I will see you guys Tuesday. And this time it shouldn't be interrupted. Alright? That's it. Bye-bye, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. The fuck was that? Gonna like the stream? Like the stream. Uh, how many times do we have to say it? You don't, you don't have a choice. It's not up to me. It's not up to you. It's up to fate. What's your statement? What was your statement? We hit our like goal. Let's go! One million likes. Oh yeah. Let's go. Wait, what's the statement? He said he has a statement. Where's the statement? I don't see no statement. Where's the statement? Oh, I hope everyone has a great day, night, and anything in between. Let's go. Sorry. Sorry about the dog. I will. I will check it out. All right. Bye. Bye for real. Bye-bye.
Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I'm going to update the background. Bye-bye.